Oh, worst oh, year I've ever in my life. Show me mm-hmm. a, 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 Critical, I'm, I'm guessing no one ever showed you Rainbow before? No, there's a, a crossing that you can use the other oh, two. It's in the under accessories. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna show Critical Rainbow. Rainbow. <laughs> 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 yeah, I Oh shit. Wait, Rainbow. <laughs> that's so that's what it's called. Uh, uh, I turned. Oh, I swear, yo, can I turned I... it live. <laughs> was it was it the butterfly that was singing the song? Yes. Yeah, dude, oh, the butterfly is. It was butterfly. <laughs> the butterfly has. That's why I was like. The butterfly. Was, the butterfly was replacing the chick. Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> it was. The butterfly was with the boot physics fan chick. Doing the um the dancing. In CD, which was really amazing. But uh, anyway, we're alive now. Oh, so, uh, sure there's still know. one person missing, and Bunkai never sent me a message back. So yeah, but uh, hello people that are watching. To the my club, we're going to do just the first ten chapters of the server. We're just about it, and uh, I let you guys do some stuff. Start with uh, Fosh, because my screen might be different. Hey, what's up? I didn't really hear what he said, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you backed out. Oh my god. <laughs> and then oh. we have uh, we have the, um, the guy with the purple armor himself. Uh, fuck you. Stop mentioning my purple armor, please. And <laughs> Critical Lemon here. Give the analysis on the first ten chapters. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> no, continue, continue, young Zaladin. Go, go. No. Uh, hi everybody, <laughs> hi everybody. Um, I'm here to give you guys a little quick, uh, quick little uh, synopsis. A synopsis. <laughs> so uh, enjoy, it. enjoy the show. Synopsis. Hey yo, hey yo, man. I'm the critical limit. I like NASCAR drinking beer. <laughs> <laughs> I like making the ah, rock I'm the critical limit. I like making them left turns. Yo, shut the fuck up. It's okay. Oh, it's okay to fuck anybody you want. Like alien I like, I, I like, I like alien. fucking my sister. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Are you going to and like, you like, retro? like watching in them if trailer park? If it's cars. true love, you can fuck anybody you want. <laughs> like the trailer park bitches, you Yo. know what I'm saying? Retro. Right, Where does this right. come from, man? <laughs> what did you say? Where did this come from, man? What did I do for both well, years? Yeah, that was so I had to go. So, Critical's, Critical's just trying to enjoy his night. You come at him with this racism? Dude, no, honestly, if you weren't going to say that, I was going to start singing the play in soul. <laughs> and, and okay, I literally... I'd literally rather you make fun of me than fucking sing the Blade and Soul. Yo, soul uh, song. Uh, yo um, Retro, you want to do a duet of the Blade and Soul ending, me and you, like, and yeah. upload it? Let's do it. You know I'm serious, We're right? We're going to do that. Go I'm ahead. Right. What's up? I'll do that. Before you have to send me, send me a clip oh dancing with, with a fan, like, just like... <laughs> got me. Uh, oh, I got you. I got you. Oh, all right, all right. Let, 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 uh, let, let Rick let Rick introduce himself, y'all. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> anime Rick, and yeah, uh, I'm here for the the, the premiere of the Hashusho Hockey Anime Club, the Manga Club thing. So let's do this, I guess. Hey everybody, my name is Ricky. Hello, boy. I kinda halfway did my homework, so I'm kinda like I didn't know it was gonna be this week. My name's Ricky. What up to everybody? And how's your cool hockey art? Oh um, uh, that's that, that that is that is me. So uh I don't I don't know where you start. Um but uh just let you guys just put out your general thoughts so far of how how you guys like me, Siren. At least so far. Wait, it's called Siren. I thought it was Poseidon, but I'm sure it's Siren. <laughs> siren, Siren, Siren. Like the like the League of Legends. Poseidon, Siren, same thing. Can we agree on that? <laughs> why not? Why not? Why not? <laughs> All right. So 
I think it was exactly like Gantz. Um, yeah. Without yeah. The, without the death. Without without the death. Well, it had death. It, no, it had the death. No, I mean, without having to die in synth theory. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, that's true, that's true, that's true. It was surprisingly more brutal than I thought it would be. It was a lot more brutal than I thought it would be. Yeah, same here. I was expecting... Oh, yeah, like, definitely I for a show to jump series. I expect everyone to live, but like, most people died on the first mission. Like, yeah, crazy. they do. That's right. But, um... Wanna go next? We'll see. I, I kind of already yeah, knew that it's more of a dark shonen. Yeah, it so is. I was ex- I was kind of expecting that, you know, going in because I have heard a lot about this series and I've actually been watching uh, a one a YouTuber by the name of Zombie Panda Dude who's doing retro reviews for this series, so I kind of knew what to expect. But um, I actually really enjoy it. And it's actually probably a series that I'm going to end up collecting because it's it's fairly short in the long run and it, it's actually really enjoyable so far. I really do like it. I like the art style they use, like the drawing yeah, I, and stuff. Yeah, I like it. I like the main character a lot. It's pretty good. Right. Yeah, he's he's interesting. But I can't even I can't even say the fucking girl's name like Amabia. Yeah, like, I think that's right. It's, it's like I'm, I'm it's like it's like a Mamma Mia. Mamma Mia Pizzeria. My name is Mamma Mia. Pizza attack. <laughs> pizza. No, but uh, all, all the characters are. I, I didn't even run into any characters I don't like. Which is, which is yeah, rare, same here. Which is rare. Even the people that died, I'm like, oh well, oh no. Yeah, I'll, <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll <laughs> say, you know who I thought would be like a major character, but wasn't that one guy with the glasses? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I knew he, he was talking about. His character design was really good. I, I'm usually like. The people with the good characters of the designs always live in showing. Yeah, know. that's true. They always live. And this guy had probably, I'm not going to lie, this guy probably had like one of the top three most badass character designs, and he actually died. Yep. Which is Because <laughs> come on, why would you waste yeah, your like, time drawing that nice ass? Why would you spend your time drawing that nice ass character if you're going to kill him? Come on, man. Damn. Yes. This is awesome. Yeah, I'm going to try to Leave it alone. That's the key yeah. living in in a, in a world like that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. There's a death flag if they have bad character design for them. Yeah. I know. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. It is, bro. Like, if you're ugly, if you're ugly and shonen, you better expect to die at one point. If you're a fat guy. You're screwed. Well, you're, people have died in shonen. Fat guys and ugly yep. guys in shonen always yeah. die. Yeah, that's true. That's yeah. sad. Oh. Hurricane hockey. Hurricane hockey. My bad. I was I was fiddling with some papers. <laughs> okay. but, um, I don't know why. Like for, for some reason. Slow, slow your roll. For some reason, like this, like the first ten chapters gave me like a bleach type of feeling. For some nah, reason. Man. A bleach. I don't know. I don't know. Like, like, conceptually, like retro, retro, retro. Give me some of that drug you you on. Yo, bro. yo, I'll give you some of that good kush. Give me some of that. Give me some of that sip. I'll give you some of that leaf. I'm sipping on that leaf. How did you get a bleach? Bleach? Um, I don't yeah, know. I'm oh, because um, I don't know why. Because like when Ichigo get a fight um, the Hollows using the world like beginning, in the Spirit Reaper. Like I don't know why, but like when like, he got he got the call, and he got like transported to other world, and he like fight those uh. What they call it, the taboo or something? Mm-hmm. The taboo, something like taboo? that. Yeah, and then like now that he's back and learning about this, it's called like psi or something, and power. All right, wait, 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 look, 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 look at this panel. Look, look at the three on the bottom. Look at the the two on the left are ugly ass motherfuckers. Like they're definitely. I, I was like they're gonna die. The guy on the right, I'm like, damn, he looks he looks decent. <laughs> but one of the ugly dudes lived. The guy in the middle. Yeah. Exactly, he did. He did. They're breaking the breaking the shown in logic here. <laughs> uh, that dude, that dude in the middle looks like a other dude. Like, looks like a white HTC. I don't, th- I don't think this is shown in logic. I think it's your logic, Alex. <laughs> oh, the guy in the middle looks like a white HTC. Looks like a gorilla. Yeah, that's about all. <laughs> okay, no, no. But seriously, critical. Tell me, the guy on the right didn't look like he would be like at least around for like another probably like thirty chapters. Come on. 
Uh, I mean, I don't really judge characters by their fucking looks, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a nice, it's a nice ass design. Come on. Man. Yeah, I'm not like, oh, this dude's sexy. You better look for another 30 chapters. No, like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> See, if I take one look at a character, I can tell you exactly how many chapters are going to last for the guy. Oh, yeah. yeah that, 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 really, that really worked out, considering he died, right? <laughs> Critical, if you were in a manga, you die, you die in the same chapter, bro. <laughs> you, know. you, would, you would die two pages after you introduced Critical. What about you, man? You're like the nerdy black kid <laughs> in You're done. <laughs> nah, man. Yo. <laughs> See, Retro would die in the same panel. I would last at least, like, I would last at least like seventy chapters. No, <laughs> I like how you have the survival. <laughs> no, you, 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 you'd be like according to my calculations. I don't Yo, die. Yo, Zalvin, 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 do you see my uh, picture? Um, let me see. Picture. No, I don't see it. Hello? Nah. I'm on Google Hangout. It looks no, blank. Oh, you can't even see it. Never mind. Is see, it like a retro, looks like that thing. retro looks like that thing in Full Metal Alchemist when they tried to to resurrect their mom. <laughs> the thing that came out. <laughs> oh my god. That's retro. Damn. Damn. What do you, what do you guys think of? <laughs> Damn. Wait, what'd you ask? Talking? I was, I was gonna. Sorry. Think of talking about this chick. All right. I'm um, yeah, whatever her name is. What, what, what exactly do you guys think about this as her, as a character? How do you guys think about her as a character? Wait, who? I'm like, I'm curious. Who? I'm a, I'm a Mia. Mia? I'm a Mia. I don't know what to expect from her yet. I, I think I think she better have like a good kind of fucking backstory or explanation for her like insanity like bullshit. <laughs> yeah, okay. she's kind of crazy. I, I'll say this. I'll say this. I don't dislike any characters, but I'm closest to disliking her. Because she's like all over the place. Like one mo- one minute she'll be like normal, the next mm-hmm. minute she'll be crazy, the next minute she'll be like helpless. Like I don't I don't know. Like yeah, yeah. I can see that. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. I, I, I like crazy bitches, you know, in series. So you know. Yeah. But Rick, he's not even completely it interesting. It makes it interesting. It makes it interesting. Makes it interesting. Dude, that's like I'm one of the like, people that actually like Lisa because she's fucking like. Okay, you know, you know, okay, okay. Yeah. I'll compare it to this. You know how you know was bipolar. Uh huh. She is like tripolar or some shit. Tripolar. Yeah, 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 it says she's got a yonder. Yeah, I, 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 honestly, though, I no. think oh, with the way she is, she probably is gonna have an interesting backstory. Yeah. So, the funny thing is, like, explain when, why like, she is the way she is. When the main character and the girl were like in the house, like he, she was helping her him out, right? But then she's like, "I'm not gonna help you." What? Like, it made no sense. Like, she's like, "I'm not gonna give you directions or something." Like, yeah, fuck? she said a few. You, you gotta you you remember though. This is a game. This is a game. This is a game. So it's like you gotta expect those twists and turns. Like but that. she can't yeah, move. Actually. She's gonna move with them. Like they're working together. Yo, we need to have I'm a Mia and uh, the main character versus you know and uh, Yuki, bro. Yeah, <laughs> that'd be amazing. Yuki, Yuki would get his ass handed to him. Like yeah, he mm. would. <laughs> I cannot say the main character's name for the life of me. I get you know. Yeah, Agiha. I like I like, Agiha. I like I like I like Yoshino. 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 Yeah. Yoshino. 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 Yeah. Damn, no, he's, he's funny. Uh, I like Agiha. He's a he's a funny dude. I like the part where he's yeah. like the girl was asking to help find her cat. And he's like, "Screw yeah. you! You find your cat yourself." He is. He just. You know what? I I get what retro because he is this kind of like he is kind of like Ichigo in the beginning of Bleach where. He should go with likable. How he's that, like he's oh. that. He could be funny for a second, but at the same time, he can be badass, kind of. Like how Ichigo yep. is in the beginning, yep. you know, when he was likable and stuff. And then I, I kind of get like. Hey, I still like Ichigo. It's, it's like I think what retro means though is like remember in the beginning of Bleach before Soul Society, it was just dealing with these random hollows and whatnot, and him learning how to be a soul, a, a Sunji Tsunigami. I mean, it's kind of like it's kind of like that in the beginning. The so I, I kind of get what retro going with I, it. The only comparison I can see to Bleach is the main character's personality. That's, that's it. That's it. Yeah. But, I mean, we do have to be, though. Yeah, because, I mean, there's nothing else. No, you go ahead, Rick. You can go ahead. I was going to say, well, I mean, also, too, we take consideration. Didn't this come out before Bleach? What? No, 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 no. It didn't. It didn't. Oh, it didn't? Okay. 
That, I, I really can't see that many similarities with Bleach except the main character. No, no, I'm not saying if there's huge similarities. I just kind of, I think I, I was just saying I kind of see where Retro's going a little bit, you know. Uh, I never see where Retro's going. So. Neither do I. I'm trying, I'm trying to help him out. I'm trying to help. I'm trying to be. I, I never, I, I don't know where I'm going either. Retro, did you see the latest episode of Hunter x Hunter? I did. So look, look, Retro, this is for you. <laughs> yo, yo, wait, wait. How, wait, how, Retro, the ending, uh, how does the ending of Hunter Retro, uh, read the Wikipedia, and that's how you saw the episode of Hunter Hunter. All right, so here we go. Here we go, Retro. This is this is what it did in the episode. Like, dun, 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 dun. yeah. Yeah. Be a match for Pearl now. Jeez, what's up with this? Yo, I'm gonna become a voice actor. I'm I'm gonna sing the end. I'm gonna sing. I'm gonna do the endings and openings, bro. You're gonna see. You're gonna be like, like uh, Asuka. Yeah, he's pretty hot. Yeah, he's My first, my first song will be like, my first rainbow song will be, show me your name, oh, oh my god. Honestly, I like the guy. Like my favorite. Critical. I like the part with the Ashiga or whatever his name is. Whenever like he did like the milk joke because he's like tall. Oh yeah, <laughs> that was good. That was like, good. you ready to drink some milk? The flashback. <laughs> the flashback he had where he drink all the milk. Are the other guys? No. <laughs> <laughs> it was a perfect yeah. payback. I'm like, wait again. You guys know what happened after that? I bet you guys don't know what happened after that. We don't. What happened? You don't want to know, bro. I saw it on. Uh, if you guys know, you guys know Pururin. Oh my god. What is it? Don't, you want to figure out what happened after that? Go to that website. Don't go there. <laughs> I don't like I don't even know what the fuck that is. Don't go there, Aki. I don't even know. <laughs> don't go there. I'm going to take your advice. Do <laughs> not go there. <laughs> I'd rather just stay away from it. You should. Yeah, honest, honestly, like, I'm not even kidding. The first chapter of this was pretty much like. Gantz, like the first mission of Gantz, like not even it's with like basically. with like very few differences too. It was it was pretty crazy. I'm I'm excited to read this. So you're saying this this is a shonen version of Gantz because you know I don't think it's gonna, I don't think it's gonna be like Gantz, but I, I can see why Zalan says like it has a similar setup at the beginning. This is like it, this is like pretty okay okay. I'm gonna say this. What happened in the first mission of Gantz happened in this uh, in this. First, like, 10 yeah, 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 I know. Pretty much. No, I, I guess your comparison. I can see, I, like I said, I can see where your comparison is going, but, like, I think it's going to be, like, different. How it, like, yeah, I agree, on. I agree. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. In the long run, yeah, it'll, 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 I can see it changing, like, long run. Yeah. Well, I don't want no aliens dipping humans in sauce and eating them and raping okay, them. And well, I don't mean that. I find the similarity to Gantz as, like, a positive, because I like Gantz, so I'm like, hell, I'm ready. I've never read Gantz, so I can't say. Yeah, I really like Gantz. I've only seen the I, I'm scared. I'm scared to read Gantz. I, I really like how they're going to have like, psychic abilities and shit. Oh, so yeah, you're, psychic you're abilities. You're scared to read Gantz? No, nah, yeah, the, the power the power is set up really, is actually really interesting. Yeah. yeah, I'm waiting to see that. The power system is really interesting. Then the, oh, the, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, the girl and the girl and the girl and the girl and the That was crazy. Oh, yeah, the chair. <laughs> yeah. I'm not like, like Justin because uh, I, I talked talk to Justin about this series. They get ridiculous in, the court, in, in going forward. Yeah, I think it's right. Yeah. Wait, would you say Rick? Yeah, like they get like stupid, stupid strong going forward. Oh, no, because Justin's read this series oh, yeah. in, in entirety. He, and I was telling him when we're starting it. He said they get they get ridiculous, like like disgusting uh, as the series goes forward. Wait, yeah, so I'm really they, do, they, do, they do nasty things. <laughs> With their I mean, they do real nasty things. I've heard is heard is one that I, I, I've always seen that one panel of like the main character, like the big ass black ball thing, the big ass panel. Big ass. But look, we're forgetting like the greatest character in like all these chapters, Alfred. We're forgetting about Alfred. Alfred's the greatest character of Alfred. Alfred was the one trying to kill them. Al Alfred's Alfred's Wait, dead. He has a name. Yeah, he had a name. He had a chapter oh. name. Yo, 
The chapter <laughs> names in this are, are crazy, dude. The chapter names. I don't look at. I never read chapter. Names. The chapter name was like I think it was like the Forbidden Human Alfred, and on the back of his neck he had Alfred. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He was he a great friend. Who cares about <laughs> Alpha, dude? Like, <laughs> I care. Yo, go <laughs> fuck yourself, critical. I was like, I, I murdered them all. He was like, I was like, fuck all y'all. Yeah. He hey, shot that one Alpha, dude in the Alpha back with the cool. arrow. Alpha was cool, <laughs> but um, he ain't James. You know, I'm just saying, he ain't James. You know, <laughs> you know he ain't James. It don't matter. <laughs> yeah, for the most part, James, James one of the greatest shonen villains ever created. Yeah, really, for the most part, the first ten chapters were uh, payback. I think the first ten chapters are pretty good. That's I want to read more. Like, I didn't want to stop. I think they're really good. Yeah, definitely. I'll just think like information wise, like nothing really was uh, uh actually chapter ten is when everything starts being much. Yeah, like the next chapter, we start talking shit out, yeah. Like, the like, <laughs> shit start you talked about. You're like, like, talking like, made, you're like talking stop at chapter stop. 10 when they're in the middle of the fucking conversation. Like. <laughs> <laughs> but it was actually before the conversation. Yeah, stop reading when it actually gets to the core part. Like, <laughs> I'm <laughs> man, man. <laughs> I'm just like, okay, guys, let's tell you about sign. Oh, wait, we gotta stop, like, fucking shit. Exactly. He's got these cool powers. Wait, next time. <laughs> I mean, look, we got some stuff, I guess, the future, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah. They go to the future, yeah. You know, their, yeah, their goal is the, the, the change, the future, you know? What else? <laughs> well, like, what I'm talking about is, like, okay, okay. She, the, the teacher, whatever her name is, mm-hmm. she got to zero, right? Yeah. Right. And nothing has really changed, right, in the future. So if they go in the future and get, like, their value gets to zero in the card, like, something's going to happen. So they have to do something to change the future because she No, it's going to be, like, one, like, I feel like getting to zero is, like, basic training for the actual shit that's going to go down later in the series. That could make sense. So like all that, all that, just like yeah. I mean, the the time travel out. element, I definitely see developing more as we go forward. I just hope it doesn't make the story like really confusing and shit. Because time travel storylines aren't my favorite thing in the world. So I've I've yeah. never got I never got why people don't like time travel. Like I don't get it. I don't say anything wrong. Oh, it's just, it's just sometimes, no, I mean, like, it's not like a terrible plot device, don't get me wrong. It can be done well, but a lot of times it's, it just makes it, there are a lot of times that it makes the story a little confusing at times, you know. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know what you mean, like, it can't be, like, overcomplicated. Yeah. I wouldn't, I wasn't going to say Steins Gates, I was actually about to say KJ Eden. <laughs> oh, Kagi, stop it. <laughs> stop it. What a, <laughs> that, that ends up. Like, yeah, time travel is empty to me because it's either done well or done, like, really shitty, so. Oh, there's not that much, like, neutral area. No, yeah. I, I have watched Steins Gate, but I heard Steins Gate mm-hmm. actually does it really well. Like, one of the best. It's really good. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. And I was actually thinking about I like Steins Gate. Like, back to the future, that's really good. I'm scared of time travel because, like, I think that me from, like, five years ago could probably kick my ass. <laughs> yeah, you also yeah. find a longer hairline too. Yeah. <laughs> Zaladin, Zaladin, you, honestly, Zaladin, you need time travel in your life because you need to do damage control. Damage can oh shit, I have no, yeah, I, have no, I, have no I have no, I have no regrets, Rick. No regrets. Start using rogue. He, he, and, uh, you you can re- if you had time rage. travel, you can repair your relationship with a certain YouTuber. I'm just saying. No, no, no regrets. Really. If you had time sure, travel, you. <laughs> If if you live your life with regrets, wait, what are you talking about, Rich? No, no, Valdez, I think you have one regret. <laughs> if if yo yo when you launch when you launch a specific no, projectile into your mouth, <laughs> not, wait wait critical, what'd you say? I said when you launch a projectile into your mouth, no, didn't you oh. regret that? <laughs> oh, <dude. laughs> oh my god! What? Oh, oh, one one is one 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 critical. I don't regret one critical critical because that happened. I will never do it again. 
critical. Do you really want to go this route right now? Do you really want to go that route? I'm going to bring because you up right here. Shut the fuck up. Because I don't have anything. Because I don't have shit. You oh, know yeah. Fuckers. I forgot you're like a Buddhist monk. Shut the fuck up. No. Critical. You're like, you're, you're like once not, a year. We're not, we're not doing <laughs> We're not doing this right now. Damn, I this, this is going to be the functional ass group. Yeah, it was this. It was this. But, um. Yeah. That's, was there really anything else in the 10 chapters? No, uh, in the 10 chapters, I'm trying to think. I can't really remember. Okay, I, I got kind of confused. Alright. And, like, mm-hmm. okay. So, with the, like, the map. There was like the gate to get out to the real world, right? Yes. And like, there, what's like the what's the tower thing? It was like a like a radio tower, I thought. Like you know what I'm talking. About? Yeah. Well, what is that thing? Uh, uh, from my from my get, it's like a trap. If you go there, you get killed. <laughs> That's what they kept saying. It's, it's like uh, it's like bait for noobs, bro. Like right. Bait. I guess. Go to that uh, shit. Go to that I guess shit. you you would assume there'd be a phone there because yeah. there's wires and things. Maybe it's what it is. So up there, little you're in, like you were saying, trap. You go there, so you see time. like. I think one time, like I'm predicting, this is my predictions for next arc. I think next time, okay. they're gonna go there, and they're gonna be like just five black guys just sitting there, like on the tower, like yo, like what you guys doing around here? That's gonna be the next arc. Just hanging yeah, around. I, I can see it, but like, I, I think critical. Know. Wait, critical, you're the one, but like the basic training, right? You said that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That kind of makes sense because, like, maybe, like, the leader is, like, um, training people for, like, the coming threat that's going to attack them. Oh, training for the future? So, ah, yeah, so, like, so you, like, prepared, then, um, yeah. you can, so you can have, like, an army to fight against. Maybe yeah. that guy's from the future. Yeah. So he knows what happens. Some future threat or something. I don't yeah, know. yeah, so then he can, like, make people strong, get power so they can fight the enemy. It makes sense. What do you guys think of the main guy's sister? She's a little, uh, little rough. Oh, she, she's like, she's one of my favorite characters, man. I like, I like that. You know, she gets that mad and Came in late. I was like, what the hell? You know, she like tied that dude up and shit. Like, yeah, she did. Hit him with like the sword, Mike. Damn. She's into that bondage type of stuff. I guess so. Shut the fuck up. What do you guys think of all the questions they're asking him on the phone? Like all the I didn't even really signing up. Shit. Yo, I was actually kind of mad that they didn't show me all the questions. All yeah, the... they should be like what sixty of them. I was, I was, I was, I actually cried like a little bit to myself. Oh damn. Why are you crying to yourself? Because I wanted, because you know when they were asking the questions on the phone. Yeah. I wanted to see each and every question, but they skipped like thirty of them. Man, I answered. There's too many damn questions, man. Yeah, but I want to know his answers, man. It tells me about him as a character. They, every character should have to do this test. <laughs> An immigration test? I want. I, w- I would like to... S- okay, look. Okay, here we go. Retro, can you do me a favor? Can you go back no. to that chapter and a- and answer all the questions in your own uh, with your own answers? I want to know about you, Retro. Oh, my God. <laughs> I want to know how you work. I want to know how your mind works. <laughs> oh, even if he answered, you still wouldn't know how. Retro, can, can I ask you the question? Do you mind? Yes. He okay, I'll ask, you. I'll ask you, bud. Oh. <laughs> I'll ask you. Okay. Go ahead and find this. I don't even know what chapter it was. It's chapter one, I'm pretty sure, right? Yep. Okay. Alrighty, I'm getting there. Here we go. He approaches the phone booth. Okay, Retro, are you ready? You ready, Retro? Yep, I'm ready. Alright, just say yes or no. Are you a Japanese older than 12? Yes. <laughs> okay. I'm not ready, dude. You're not are you, Retro, are you worried about the future of your country? No. Damn, man. Holy <laughs> okay. Have you ever suffered a brain injury or a bit? I'll, I'll answer for you. Yes. Okay. Um. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> well, well, actually, I actually have. I knew it. I, I said I'll answer for you. Okay. Do you have chronic difficulty breathing, or have you ever felt that your planet's atmosphere is difficult to breathe in? That's a tough one. 
What? This is a tough one. Hmm. Hurry. Nope. Okay. Um, have you ever dreamed of talking sheep? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Do you believe sheep. there's life in outer space? <laughs> Oh, that's definite. Yes. You, you already know that. <laughs> what a coincidence that Retro would get this. Yeah. All right. Question twelve. Even if you couldn't communicate verbally, you could get your thought. Could you get your thoughts across? So yeah. Yes. Okay. Have you ever been? Ble have you ever bled blue blood? Yes. All the time. Do you prefer a mountain blue of blue blood. blood? Do you prefer a mountain of mushrooms over a village surrounded by a bamboo forest? <laughs> yeah, that question, though. <laughs> that question. <laughs> Which one? No. Okay, okay. So you, <laughs> you prefer you prefer the uh, village of bamboo? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. He's like, no, it's not a yes or no question, though. You have? Do you, do you have close friends? <laughs> no. <laughs> have they whipped you with Twizzlers? They <laughs> have. <laughs> have you ever killed a living thing larger oh than a human? No. Have you ever jumped a fellow human? <laughs> no. You lie. Why are you lying? You're liar. Yeah. Okay. Have you ever poured water hotter than eighty degrees Celsius on your face? I don't think so. All right. Totally. Last, last, two last two questions. Last two questions. You feel unsatisfied with high school, high school life? Yes. Do you think anything of the future? Yes. All right. Last question. You have no desire to honor the curfew your family set. <laughs> 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 I don't have a curfew. Right so. right on time, man. That's, All right. That's it. Thank, thank you for answering, uh, Retro. You lied on a few, but whatever. What was the final? That, what was the point of answering the questions? They already knew the answer. You no, know, Retro, Retro. I hope, I hope you know that you that it, since you answered those questions, you're now going to be abducted by aliens, right? Nice. <laughs> so I, so I, vacation. That's what I always wanted. Your worst fear, basically, is going to come true. I think you'd be happy. I might be. <laughs> so, so hockey. I have this question for you. Would you? Okay. So far, would you rather be in Gans or be in Siren? Siren. Of course, easy. That, that was an easy question. Because, because even even like even based off the first thing. Yeah. People, I think they know they died in Gans. The first mission was so fucking bad. Honestly, yeah, honestly, the Gans missions were, okay, this was a fair mission, I can say that. The Gans missions were unfair. Like, what the fuck? Exactly, yeah. This mission, this mission the was siren, the thing is, so they would have been dumbasses. Like. <laughs> well, yeah. And the thing about everything seems normal. Like, yeah. You leave, and it's a normal city. Siren, so you know, you go, thing, you might, your head might blow up. Besides yeah. Siren, they kind of they could have listened to him, but they didn't, and they end up going to the tower. And then... Yeah, but um, all right, but and, and in Siren, you get your you get powers. That, that's better. In Gantz, you don't get shit. You had a suit. That's it. Yo, the suit gives yeah. you powers. So <laughs> it's a trade off. I'm, I'm gonna ask the same question every manga club. Though. I, I want to see if it if it gets uh, scarier. It probably will. I don't know, man. Like, they, get, they get abilities. <laughs> I know it, it, it's. I know it's not going to get as scary as Gantz. No, it's, it won't. It won't. No oh, shit. You can be like on oh, a scale of one to Gantz. What is I this? Said it, I said it a lot of times. In Gantz, I would have probably ended up killing myself eventually. Like that shit is. Heavy. I think some, I think you would have died. Like you wouldn't have had, had to kill yourself. All right, so I think if we all made a Gantz team, the first person to die, I think we get agree would be Retro. Retro would be like, I'm not putting on the suit. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I don't want to talk about that. Be like, be like, no, Retro would be like, you guys look retarded in that. You guys look stupid in that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> 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 yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I don't want to. Only the the aliens. Aliens. Retro, Retro would try to ask the aliens if he could join their side or something. <laughs> <laughs> the aliens will fucking kill you with fucking fried chicken because they fucking persuade you. 
know what the hell? They give me some fucking. No, we we have a recording. Yo, HTC has a recording of Retro saying. Fuck people with food stamps. We have that, <laughs> we have that recorded, Retro. Oh, retro I know we do. You are done. Retro, I'm going to send that to your college. Yo. They're going to be like, yo, <laughs> Conrad Kelzinski, here's a recording of him saying fuck people with food stamps. <laughs> do they probably hate him too? Damn. <laughs> yo, Retro, you're going to hell, dude. My school, like, you have to have at least, like, a 94 average again, that bitch, so I'm pretty sure... What's up with your food stamps? Is, I'm pretty sure you're fucking food stamps. You're fucking not smart. I heard that if you want to get into the University of Buffalo, you just gotta... You just gotta fax them one of your food stamps and they look at you. I actually have a suspicion... I was right. uh, that's, that's how retro got it. Oh, shit. Yeah, Zal, Zal and he jumped someone for food stamps and then, like, got in. <laughs> so, like, they're sending it. Alright. Yo, Rick, calm down. <laughs> Alright, guys. One more, one more question, and it is uh, what do you guys think their abilities are going to be? Just so you might, just in case you, you might be right. So see, like, man. I don't know. Okay, see, here's the thing you I want to know. know. That's why I said, what do you think? <laughs> from from what it looked like, I'm pretty sure this is all. This is not true, but from what it looked like, her and her teacher had the same ability. Did they? She didn't even show off her ability, did she? Well, yeah, she did something. I, she did something with like the arrow. I don't know exactly what she was doing with that. Yeah, I think what she did with the arrow was she used like telekinesis or whatever to like slow it down, and she gra so she grabbed it. Or she I don't know. Like, or she made she it could be it could be like time really. manipulation type of thing. Yeah, right? it could freeze time. I could see that work for her. Hey, like slowing down cool. time. I mean, if she free, okay. If she I mean, not freeze time, time. Not freeze okay. time, but like slow it down. So why would she want to hold on to like the arrow? Or she could she could have done something that like augments her own physical ability or something. Like but like, uh, honestly, is, I don't think that's what is, it is. Does the teacher like have like the goddamn like force push or something? Like fucking like, that's just telekinesis, I think. Yeah, like, that's telekinesis. Yeah. Oh, I think okay. I I think they have the same power. I'm not sure, but I think they have the same then, power. Then then um, like, you think they're gonna have like the same general. I don't, uh, think, I, don't, I, don't think they, I don't think I don't think they have the same power. Yeah, okay, here's here's what I think. Here's what I think. I think that everyone starts off with that power, but the more you use it, I think you develop like your own personal power after that. I don't know. That's what I think is gonna happen. I think I think they like you start with different basics and you like extend from there. Right. I think so. Too. I think everyone like, starts like I, I, think, their own I think there's like different like categories of like psychic power that you can get into. You know, yeah, I mean because it's your own mind, so it's probably your own. Like, uh, like I, I have no idea for the maker. Like they, they might have like like all might have like access to like telepathy or something, but I don't know about like anything else. Like I like the main character. What do you think? Rick Powers, like no idea. No. All right, huh? Say, what do you think? What do you, what do you think? I, I think, the, I think like, the more you use your powers, it's kind of like a learning curve kind of thing. Yeah. So the more you use it and the more you get more adapt to it, the stronger they're going to become. Um, you know, because if, if it's psychic-based, and that's kind of saying the more you understand your abilities, and, you know, if they really, if they really play with the whole psychic aspect, you know, and that's be how they, like, take it. Kind of like how, you know, how... Nen, where they make their Nen abilities kind of up in a sense, but with you know restriction, and whatnot. Similar to that, where like their psychic abilities and properties, they'll probably be able to mold into something that matches their style of some sort. Interesting. What do you guys think about that, huh? I, agree. Good, yeah. uh, I think the main dude is gonna have kind of like projectile weapon or. I agree with Rickson. Like I mean, what I Rick says, is, I, I, I think that's pretty much. Main. I want the main character to have lightning. That'd be sick. I have, I have a question. Lightning, yeah. have a quick, quick question. Quick question. Is my heart on the right or left side of my chest? 
I could agree with what Rick says, though, because... Uh, well, Rick said pretty much like... That'd be the best way to go about doing it. I think that's how it's going to go, yeah. 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 I mean, that's obviously, the, the more they use their ability, I mean, the stronger it's going to be. Boring as hell, if they all look the same. Yeah. If they all the same, it would be boring. Yeah, it would be. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, no, no. Like, look, we could all, all, all just have a select. <laughs> I mean, this is, I mean, like... This series, this series has a lot of potential, but, like, any shonen... You know, it has to develop as it goes along. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So, but I mean, I think it's gonna it's gonna kick up like really fast because we do know it is it is a fairly short series for a show for a shonen. It, it's like what a hundred something chapters. Yeah. So it's it's a fairly short series. So eventually, like though, the ball's gonna get going really quick. I, I don't even I don't even consider from what I've read so far. I don't even consider this like shonen shonen. Like I don't really. No, it's dark shonen. It's I'm not dark okay. like shonen. This, this already has deviated. The the, the psychic powers are gonna have a shikai and a bankai. Shikai. Oh, retro, retro. Where'd you get, where'd, where'd you get that idea? I, I, I hope not. That so retro, retro. Can, retro can, can you explain yourself, man? How, why do you think I that? I don't know, man. Cause like, if they all start with their own like telekinesis or whatever the power is, everyone, everyone, never, police, I'm, I'm <laughs> everyone, he starts off with a random ass sword. So, you know. Oh, man. You know, I, 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 thought, I thought I like Bleach. You know, Retro, though, he's got an easy. Bleach everywhere. He's everywhere, man. <laughs> that, that's a Retro shouldn't go. Bleach, bleach power scheme is simple but good. I liked it, but... I don't know. Yeah, I, I like the Bleach power scheme when, when, it, was, when it was good, when it, when it actually was consistent. No, I, I, like, I like it, but I don't... Okay, see, the thing... Okay, we're going off top of it. I just want to say this. The thing I don't like about Bleach Power Scheme is how, like, you can you can basically train, and then apparently you can do, like, ex- like the, whole, the whole new training thing they're doing right now. I, I don't like that. I don't like that. The Bleach Power Scheme is, is in a sense, an, a, a way, same as the Gray Man. And they're going to go on top of it, wrap this up. The gray man's power scheme is like if you centerize with your innocence, you get stronger. Right. You know, by various way. Bleach, you if you harmonize and you talk and you connect with your Zapakdo, you get stronger. So, you know, same same scenario, same scenario. Kubo, Kubo is, it's all about the soul thing and everything. He uses the power of his pen to create new abilities. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. I mean, I'm just wondering where my boy Ichigo is at. He says he's gonna save his soul society. I haven't seen it for twenty chapters. I'm just saying. Well. I'm just saying. Don't you know that all the heroes... We, we, we can talk, we can continue this conversation off-air. Yeah, 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 yeah. Retro. But honestly, I actually know... I can't, wait, I can't wait to see... Like, I, just I, ask, so. I can't wait to see the villains. I, I want to see the mastermind villains. Like, I, And I actually heard that there are some pretty good villains in this series. And I can't wait to meet them. Actually, you know what this gives me also? This gives me a Batum feel. Batum. Yeah. It's only recommendations why for it, too. Why? Because it's the game? <laughs> because, yeah, I mean, because, their lives, basically. because I don't know why the girl reminds me of the girl from Betoom, like, appearance-wise. First mm-hmm. of all, it does. It does. Um, the, whole, the whole, like, wasteland kind of thing, the, the, the setting looks the same. Um, Wait, Batoom was in the wasteland? It's not really that similar to me. Batoom, they had, people, like, people killing each other. Batoom was, like, an island. Like Bitu, yeah, it was an island, but it had some like parts that looked like wasteland. Like, remember, it had like a forest, a beach, a wasteland. Oh, I'm sorry, it has like one like panel of wasteland. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, how you feel about getting us uh, slapped upside your head? How you feel? About <laughs> 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 that that sound that's not appetizing. Yo, yo, yo critical wall, make a left turn. Making them left turn. Retro, retro, you 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 want you want one too? Yeah, dude. I love some slides. Yo, retro, I, I see that V neck, bro. <laughs> Get the <laughs> fuck out. Oh god, now it's getting quick. The second Anybody, I said V uh, neck, he he pulled it up. <laughs> uh, any uh, anything else they want to put in about the series so far? What anything? Nope, gotta read more. <laughs> Can't wait. Yo, hockey. Yeah. I want to see the powers. That reminds me of uh, Victorine from Zatch Bell. Yo, wait, <laughs> like when do, when's the next uh, thing? We have to read ten more or whatever. That's what I was gonna ask. Next week. Also, 
But how do you want to do these things? Like, what are you guys really? Are you guys really free on Thursdays? Yes. I know Rick is. Hockey. I'm free, out, I'm free on Thursdays at like, the same time. Like I like nine. The thing that happened with me, why I showed, <clears throat> why I showed up late was because my friend's birthday was today, but I never knew because I don't know people's birthdays. So. I feel like we should do this like at nine o'clock. So like ten thirty because you know. It, it, is this time good? Like, what do yeah, we do? It, okay, it'll it it pretty much always be good for me. I will tell you, like, if anything comes up, but it's always like I'm literally, I literally have nothing to, I have no life. Uh, so. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know I, for me because I got school I still. Anything. I still have school, so I, like ten thirty is kind of. I'm a, I'm on summer vacation think, starting. Yeah, right, retro. Isn't you? Aren't you in like your senior year or something? Yeah. Well, actually, we are in retro because actually we're supposed to start at six. But so, Zalad didn't want me to push it back. So he, like nine, nine o'clock. Yeah. Are we doing yeah, these weekly? Or are we doing these right. bi-weekly or <coughs> weekly? Please. Week, weekly. Yeah. I was thinking of doing it weekly just because you can do it. It'll be it'll be done quicker. And all right. So ten chapters in episode, right? Are, I mean, that's what I was gonna ask. That, that's another thing. Do you think ten chapters is too short, or, or what? I think I I think ten chapters is too short. I honestly do. Yeah. Um. It's gonna take a long time for us to finish. I think series. at least like, I I think we can try. I'm not saying we should. I'm saying we should try for like thirty. But I'm not saying we should. I don't know. For thirty. I could do thirty. Thirty. Um, yeah, I mean, it's not hard. Just read like five chapters a day. Like, not even. Thirty is not much, and it actually gives you like a lot to talk about. You know? like, yeah, that's true. Or I'm just saying. The only, reason, the only reason I had it at 10 because I know everybody has, a, well, people will have their own things to do. That's why I had it at 10. I say 20. I say, I mean, all right, we're going to do, let's just, let's, just do, let's do with 20 then. If we want to do how more. About, I say how about we do a, an arc? An arc? No, well, the thing is, the thing is, though, are kind of, I'm not, I have, I have, I'm rereading this thing right now with you guys, so I can't remember exactly how the arcs, how they work in this series exactly. Well, if we because go into like, we, the Wikipedia, does it have a good? Does it have a detailed Wikipedia page? I let, have no let idea. Retro, let Retro read the wiki for it. He's good at that. Uh, <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah, Sam. They help people stuff. No, big, because like because, there are a lot of Wikipedia pages for mangas, they'll tell you like, all right, this arc is from this chapter to this chapter. Oh, okay. Well, if somebody looks up, you can let me know because when we did Trace, Trace was easy to tell the arc because every chapter was literally named after that arc. So it'd be the blah blah blah. This blah blah, but there's have the same name, but this is a different part. So it's easy to tell when the next one happens. But for Sire, it's totally different. So I don't. Mm. So um, we can do it by arc. If uh, somebody gets a fucking arc, list. <laughs> look it up or something. Yeah. Depends on what arc is. <laughs> oh, what's it that, that retro handle? Oh, okay. the uh, well, the arc is. Well, the arcs in Sire can't be that long. It, it's true. probably like it's probably gonna be like Gantt style, like permission. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. But um, until yeah. they get like out of it, it's probably like a lot. It's probably a bunch of like mini arcs. So we'll just stick with weekly, since I'll, that's the easy way for me. And I have another question: Are we switching? Are we gonna switch yeah. genre every time? Okay, every, manga. Genre? every manga. Well, we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna. Every, well, depends on if you guys want to break, since you, you know, after this one, you know, yeah, the next bro, series, we we're just gonna we'll after it, the vote. We'll just vote on. Um, like I have a list. You can list and shit. So we we'll okay. just have like have a vote on like a uh, maybe I'll pick two and we'll vote on two. Actually, the next I, series I, I would I would, I would Cage of Eden. Um, Let's, oh let's put oh, old, no. old boy on that on that list. Who? What? Old, old boy. boy. Oh, actually, I don't have old boy on here. Wait, old boy? Yeah, it's ba- it's um it's that's a manga. Con- a contra- uh, there was a movie a contra- called. Old boy. <laughs> that's, a con- <laughs> that's a contradictory name. <laughs> Leave it to Zal. Then. I'm not. I'm that's not, a manga I've been wanting to read for a long time. I'm sorry. Ago. I'm not reading old boy. It's too contradicting. <laughs> 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 it's, it's that's bad writing. It's, like, it's like an oxymoron. <laughs> that's bad writing. Oh boy. See, see I, I was gonna say something, but that might be that might be mean. Were you were you, were you about to call me an old boy? Because <laughs> 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 Yeah, 
Yo, I bought Reed uh, King the whole way. But um, anyway, anyway, the next series I had was Cage Eden or Akamets 2. And <laughs> I think more majority of people already read Cage of Eden now. <laughs> Fuck that shit. <sighs> oh, can so we do plan uh, album, it no, might be Aquaman. Mm. Oh, yeah, Actually, I don't know what I was was what about what about Soul Eater? When we gonna when we gonna? Twentieth Century Eater? Boys is one of those manga that everyone <laughs> everyone <laughs> says they want to read, but no one's actually read it. Yeah, I've read that, like, is, that I, is true. I literally that, own it, but I don't really read it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't, you don't read it. Exactly, everyone says they want to read Twentieth Century Boys, but they've never read it. <laughs> Dude, though, there's, there's, there's so many manga that are like that. Everybody says they want to read Vagabond, but no one reads. You know. Yeah. Everybody that's... says they want to read um, freaking Monster. No one does it. Exactly. I've read Vagabond and Monster. So many series like that. Like everyone's like, Yo, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna watch the anime for Monster, and I'm gonna do. I was about to read that, but you never do. I heard the anime. I heard the anime is more enjoyable than the manga. Uh, for what? They're, they're about equal. Yeah, it's fine. You can watch yeah. the anime. Nine. Uh oh. All right, well. <laughs> For the next one, nice. You gotta just figure out. I gotta figure out what's the next one. <laughs> no, uh, Retro, were you but, there uh, when ATC's mom came in? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, she was like, what the fuck you <laughs> doing? Yeah. Boy, boy, what are you doing, boy? Like, what the fuck you doing on the computer today? <laughs> Show me, show me. Yo, let hockey sign out, you faggots. No, we're singing. No, no. I was gonna say this one thing. Do uh, do you guys have anything else you want to talk about or uh, or say? Wait, about about this series? For this, for the, um, these chapters. Um, I, think, I think we covered everything. Uh, yeah, so far, I'm just saying, like, like for closing, just for closing up. You went over there? You said everything you had to say? Uh, all right, all right. Everybody had, everybody said everything? Yeah. Oh, oh my god. Like, there's, like, I'm trying to think of something, but, like, well, I mean, I was the end it. I wasn't going to end it. I was just going to let um, just be open discussion. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Continue like, doing what you're doing. Like, I'm trying to think, like, about, like, <laughs> like not that so much stuff happened. You read the chapters. Not that so, much stuff yeah. happened. It's just an open discussion now, so whatever you want to talk about. Make fun of, you can make fun of each other. Who wants, who wants to talk about some uh, some seasonals? Oh, well, let's, let's shoot. Yo, wait, wait, wait. Hockey, hockey. I would really like, though, at some point, though, to cover D. Gray, man. Even though I know it's not finished and it's on hiatus. Yo, I still need to read that shit. Like, I've, like, watched the mop, like, anime. I've, I've seen, like, 30 episodes of an anime. Okay, I fucking yeah. love it. I'll, I'll put D. Gray, man. I haven't, on here. I haven't like, I have some other stuff on here. D. Gray, man? I don't know. Uh... D. Gray Man. You don't like yeah, D. Gray Man? Um, guy in the purple armor? You don't like D. Gray Man? No, I, I, I like D. I yeah, like D. Gray Man. I don't know what your YouTube is. It's not that I like Josh. Because I, I like Josh, or do I, I call you. I like the name, the D. D. Gray Man. I like that. Shut the fuck up, though. You can call me Josh, it doesn't really matter, but. Uh, D. Gray Man. D. It's not that I don't like D. Gray Man. D. Gray Man. I don't know. Scribble just hates on. Series. I don't hate on series. What the fuck? Hey, do. Okay, I do, but the gray man, I haven't hate on. <laughs> he, 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 he just hates like, on series. No, he just hates on series that I enjoy. That's it. What are you talking like? What? Can you give me an example? Um, All right, so guys, let's talk about the best anime the gray man. of the decade. <laughs> you, what did I say about the gray man? Blade and Saul. No. Wait, retro. Yeah. Retro. Wait till you get to the um, to the Edo arc. Do no, I heard. I want it. Okay. I want I cloud cl uh, clown something. What's that mm -hmm. shit called? That shit. Clowning around. Got mad like. <laughs> uh, I love the main character. Talking about, like, I think we can all agree that. Uh, yeah, Alan, I like Alan. Alan, Alan cool. Yeah. yeah like Alan clown. Yeah. No, I just got to the part where the one. Fuck. 
forgot where I am. Shit, I don't even know where I am. What episode are you on? I don't even know. It's been a while since I've seen it, but... I remember, like, I the think, anime I, ends, like, I a think, <laughs> No, because like, I'm in the 50s, but there are so many filler episodes. That I just, oh, yeah, yeah, there are. They're a shit ton. Mm, actually, they're not filler. They're, they're not... Some of them aren't filler, though. They're from the light novel. Well, there was one about, like, a, a mech attacking a city, so... I don't think that's really part of the series. But, um... So... We can all agree though that Blade and Souls CG was pretty pretty good. Yeah, yeah. I, I agree with that. Yeah. I liked yeah. the CG breasts when the woman <laughs> bent down, and they went like this kind of. <laughs> it was crazy. That was pretty crazy. In 19 seconds. <laughs> uh, yes, 19. Yo, <laughs> how do you remember the time, dude? Yeah, <laughs> kind of his favorite. Yo, yeah. Critical probably watched that shit a lot, a lot of times. He, he probably did. He, Look, he, he, he hates so, on the ending, too. Who here saw that Brynhildr in the darkness or whatever? Of course I have. Episode 2, yes. It is. Does, does it? Okay, so, so what are your thoughts on it? I've, I've read the manga. What, what are your thoughts on it, Yo, I, um, Captain Earth, the first episode, it's really interesting, but what the fuck is going on? It's aliens, look, man. Aliens. Invade Earth. Who's, 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 Here's what you got to do these series, man. Every, everything that this guy does is always like this. You don't know what the fuck's going on, but you're like, whatever, you like it. You're just like, that, it that's, right. <laughs> that's all you have to do. Be truthful, because everything will explain itself as it goes on. Yeah, that's right. I figured. It's, it's, you're always... It's really interesting. Something that's already going on. Yeah, like for Star Driver, something was already going on. We were thrown into the middle of it. We don't actually know exactly until stuff starts getting uh, revealed. So it's kind of the same now. Like we don't exactly what the fuck is going on. But yeah, you know what but, interesting? Uh, it felt like I was watching an anime movie awesome. because yeah. that's how a lot of anime movies work sometimes. Where like if you you're you already you're thrown into the middle of something, and as the movie progresses, you know you find out what's really going on. That's what it felt like. Right, and yeah. it's 26 episodes, so I mean you got a while to. Oh, good. Back. Okay, cool. Yeah, um, I will say though, I will that that, trans- that transformation, like on some Super Sentai mech shit, that was awesome. cool, but it's way too long, and I hope that shit doesn't have to happen in every single episode. I don't think it will every episode. Is that that like, you, even, even even Star Driver skip some of that sometimes? What? Is that what fight you're with the Elder Darkness? Wait, what'd you say about it? Yeah, like what do you you asked a question about it, right? Yeah, I asked uh, why. Why did he fucking blend the cake and force it down that poor girl's throat? And that's pretty gross. I was well, like, what, what do you mean? She, can't she eat. wanted some cake. Yeah. She has to, She can't just eat it. But that was cru- that was cruel, man. No, what do you mean? She can't. She can't fucking chew. I'm just kidding. Okay, so do you? Okay, well, what do you? What do you guys like the series? I, I want to ask that. Do you like the series? Yeah. It's it's okay. I think it's it's not See, the like, best thing, but I don't it's alright. Why? Like I okay. I'll say this. I like it, but I don't. Nothing more than like like it's just like what. Well, I, I don't, think, here. I don't know. Often leave? I don't know if I like it yet. Yeah. Uh, I started. I I watched some of it. I, I wasn't interested. I it's by the same person who made. Okay. Look, I don't know. Mom, Go ahead. Uh, the anime is boring. No, I'm just saying the anime is boring. I don't know. The manga is bad. <laughs> well, they, they turn it all the jelly. I was like, oh, like damn. The anime, in the first episode, they added like the pool scene for no yeah. fucking reason. Like the pool scene was you. I mean, <clears throat> I don't know, man. I I don't. Okay. I'll know if I like it or not based on where it's going. But I wouldn't recommend anyone to watch it. Like I wouldn't tell anyone to watch it. But there you go. Yeah, that's a good point. But, I mean, I guess. I mean, it's not bad. I like the the opening. I like a lot. It's not bad. Oh, I like the opening though. Holy shit! I love mm-hmm. that shit. There's no no I, singing. I was just... listening to that shit since like the trailer came out. I can love that shit. Yeah. But I like Show Me Rainbow more. Show me rape. Yo. Yeah, show me. No. What is this? What does this make you think of? Show me rainbow. Show me rainbow. He's gonna murder someone. 
I've been saying I've been saying that for the, for the longest time. Yeah, that shit is stuck in my head. I don't know. Thanks. It's oh, now stuck in my head. Thanks. You know, you, know, yo, you know what else is stuck in my head, dude? You know what else stuck in my head? Stardust. Oh, I don't watch JoJo's. Oh, no. I don't watch JoJo's. I don't, I don't. So, the end of the JoJo opening with the guy just going. <laughs> <laughs> that JoJo like opening fucking sucked, dude. It it sucks for you. It's so much worse than the first two. So I wouldn't like, say it's so. It, it's worse, but I wouldn't say it's so much. Worse. See, I think the second opening was the best. I would give that like a, a nine point five out of ten. No, uh, first one. The first one I would give like a eight point five. This one I would give a seven point five. I give this one a three. Yo, Zelda. Three? Where you on? The first one was just a beast. The first one was too tight. The first one was the best one, dude. Nah, I like the second one. Though. I'm not lying. I, 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 I watched the first two. I watched the first two. It's like a bloody stone. It's looking like a bloody stone. It, it, it looks really great. But I don't get why everyone is like fangasming. Like, oh my god, it's it's the greatest thing ever. The okay, greatest okay. I'll, I'll, say this, I'll say the visuals in this opening are better than the other ones. See, tell, tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm wrong. I don't remember the visuals. I remember the visuals song. The like, visuals are wrong. better. The song uh, is worse. Well, yeah, the visuals in the first song were just CG. Like, <laughs> I mean, no, this one is just CG too. It's just better. <laughs> to be quite honest, though, the visuals in the no, opening are such a clusterfuck. They, I mean, they really are. I mean, it's like I don't think the opening's bad, but it's like the they are. It's not like so, shit. It's, it's just so fucking clustered. Like, wait, in, wait, on? in this one, in this opening. Yeah, in this opening of JoJo's. What? Really? Yeah. Yeah, man. It looks clean as hell to me. I don't know. My, honestly, my favorite opening is the fairy tale opening, but I, I love both. Like, oh, 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 <laughs> my favorite opening is probably, um, probably Captain Earth. Captain Earth is good. It's a tie between that one and uh, Black Bolt for me. For like a bloody yeah. stone. Black Bolt, man. I hate that shit. Right now. Oh, no. I know he does. I don't like know. I, 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 I honestly don't like any openings like so far. <laughs> oh, okay, I think no. they're all mediocre. And tonight we stand together. Oh, I like Haikyuu's. <laughs> right. Like even Haikyuu's are yeah. too. Oh, it's it's alright. It's not that good. Hey hockey, are you doing your favorite endings for the season two so far? Video? You say you don't like no opening, Dan? Yeah, I don't like any of them. Yo, Dan, I have a question, dude. Mm. If we were in JoJo's, would you be like on my in my squad? Like, we'd be in the squad. Yeah, I'll be in your squad. I'll be Wait, squad. You say, you say no? Hell no. What the fuck, bro? Yo, I'll be hell squad. no. I'll be no, my stand, my stand would wreck the. Fuck out of you, Dan. They would fuck you. I would just I mean, Dan is kind of lone wolf. Be, like he, he wait, wait. It has, it has to have a color in it, right? Mine will be watermelon black, though. That's true. <laughs> black. It's a watermelon. It's a oh, watermelon fun. black. Right? Hockey's would be like brown bread or something. It doesn't need that color. Take it brown. It would be a loaf of bread. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Just to go off the season, though, like, all right. All right. Dan, Dan, I, I gotta talk to you. You, you, you seriously think Thor, Thor two is better than Winter Soldier? I think it's way better. Like no competition. <laughs> wow. Like I honestly, I was I mean, watching that stream. You guys overhyped the fuck out of Winter Soldier. Like I honestly didn't. I don't know. Think it was Everyone know, but even Hawkeye was like it was really, really good. I, I put, I put, too. I put Captain America on the same level as Hawkeye in terms of likability. Like I don't, I fucking hate both of them. I'll agree that it was better than Iron Man 3, because Iron Man 3, in my opinion, was the most disappointing Marvel movie I've seen yeah, in a oh, boring ass time. But I just don't think it's better than Thor 2. I don't. You see, for me, for me, Phase 2 <laughs> the Winter Soldier was, was, was a disappointment, because I don't like the fact that I don't feel it's really been connecting like it should, like it did in Phase 1. But then you, but then you see Winter Soldier, and it's like, yo, you see like the setup for... Um, it's... The setup is it's it's vague, but you really gotta think about it. But it's like totally like everything's right there for, for Avengers: Age of Ultron. And, oh, and you mean Avengers. the setup for the next Avengers movie? Yeah, everything's there. The reason why they're gonna make Ultron, um, I like the fact you know the after credits with you know the fact those two I think are gonna be Hydra agents, which is 
I didn't see that coming at all. I don't know. Just it just really got me like now. I mean, I just started set up uh, because Guardians is going to set up Phase Three. They already said that. So that's everything in Guardians is going to mainly affect Phase Three. Mm hmm. Well, I guess it did set it up more. I guess Thor Two didn't really set up anything. Because like even like Thor Two, yeah, Thor Two set up actually more for Thanos than Phase Three. Loki so. Two was that a good move? Sure was. Amazing. No, yeah, I mean, I'm gonna see what happens in Thor Three. I'm not. I mean, I didn't hate Thor Two by any means. The only one I actually hate was Thor. They're making a third one. Wow, I didn't know that. I mean, I'll, I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Iron Man sets up the whole Avengers uh, theme more than Thor. I'm just basing them off of movies, like themselves individually. Which one I like more? I just no, think I Thor. No. Thor you know, blew that out of the water. water. You know, I'm not trying to. I mean, but like, I just like like. There's a lot of like, even like the fights. You, I love the fights. Mm hmm Yeah. They were how they had that like like look. I mean honestly I would even go as far as that. I think there's some of the best hand to hand fight scenes in, in comic books. And that includes Blade too, with uh Nomad versus Blade. I've never seen Blade, uh, I can't say. <laughs> oh don't uh, if you're gonna, if you want to see Blade, just watch the first two. Don't watch Blade Trinity. Mm hmm okay. Oh yeah. Is Blade the one with fucking that black guy? What was his name? Wesley Snipes. Uh, Wesley, it's Wesley Snipes. Wesley Snipes. Yeah. yeah, yeah, don't don't watch that. Don't watch it. Don't watch yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty bad. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. As a, as, don't no, watch no, it. No, Blade 1 and 2 is good. Just, I heard rumors that it has a blank. I don't watch it. I don't watch it. <laughs> <laughs> Wesley, he, he's literally black. <laughs> he's literally black. Yeah, Wesley Snipes is darkest. Everyone watching the stream, is making a petition to not have the Black Panther movie made. Yeah, I'm, uh, basically... What we're trying to do in my organization, we're trying to recast all the black main characters to <laughs> different races in order to make it more diverse. <laughs> that's, that's the opposite of diverse. Fucking <laughs> Zalman. <laughs> that's the opposite of diverse. So I have Mexican Captain America one day. <laughs> Captain in Mexico. <laughs> we got we gotta make a poll in, uh, in, in we gotta make a poll who is more. So we're trying to make we're Paladin. trying to make Holly we're trying to make Hollywood more diverse in my organization. <laughs> okay, cool. Like when he saw Green Lantern was fucking Ryan Reynolds instead of like someone black, he was like, yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> not not but see, like, the thing about Green Lantern isn't there. There's a green. They just chose the wrong lantern. Yeah, right. there, there, there's different lanterns. Honestly, yeah, it wouldn't on. have worked if they chose the Black Lantern. It wouldn't have worked. Why hockey? Like, wait, wait, hold on. Why, why is that? Why? Are you asking me why? Okay, yeah. Yeah. I'm glad you asked. It wouldn't have worked. What? It wouldn't have worked if they chose the Black Lantern because he is African American. <laughs> they can't. They couldn't choose him. With anything. You, you catch. You catch my drift. That you. You know what I'm saying, right, Dan? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna say this. I don't know if I should. I'm gonna say this anyways. <laughs> retro, you're retro. You're an Uncle Tom, bro. No, okay, okay, <laughs> okay. I think I think my mom's racist. Well, no. <laughs> Yo, yeah. retro, your mom's racist? No, no, no. no. Think, no she doesn't try to be racist, but like the shit she says. Like, well, is, is she foreign? Because all foreign no, parents are yeah, racist. She, yeah, yeah, she is foreign. Yeah. Like, okay. So, like she was. We were watching ESPN. And there was a black guy on the screen. And then she's like, oh, it's a chocolate man. I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I think she likes I think she likes the chocolate man. I'm like, mom, that, you're not supposed to say the chocolate man. And then she's like, well, am I supposed to say African American? I'm like, yes. I'll, I'll, I'll I'm supposed to say that. that racist and stuff. Tell her she's supposed to say it's a nigga. <laughs> <laughs> it's worse, bro. No, it's not. Trust me. Um. See, okay, common misconception. People think that black people don't like being called that. They actually like it. They're just playing hard to get. So, yeah, call them. <laughs> you got to look them in the eye and say it. <laughs> and and sure. the harder the R is at the end, the more they like it. Trust me. Oh, jeez. <laughs> you should say the harder the R. Yeah, you got to say the R. Like, uh, uh. You got to <laughs> <laughs> Trust me, I, I've I've been I've been I've been around more than you guys. I've been in the game. I know how, I know how it's played. You know the game. Yeah. You've been the games out. The game. That's how, how long how long were you in how long were you in the games, Alan? The Game of Thrones. Uh, about 
About not nigh, nigh on nigh on seventy years. A few weeks. Mission Game of Thrones. Mission Game of Thrones. A few weeks. Who else is happy that you know? Certain someone. A certain yeah. someone. See, Spoiler. Spoiler. I think I'm, I'm really happy. I'm one of the few people that think that he was on the path to recovery. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Wait, who was on the path to recovery? Yes, you think Joffrey? You think I have, Joffrey proof? Was on the path I have to proof. I have proof. <laughs> I have proof. What, you, what's you, proof? You, Marjorie, Marjorie was positively influencing him. Am I wrong? Yeah, and that shit all went down the drain when he was at the wedding. <laughs> no, 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 no. Rick, Rick, Rick. All right, let's let's compare it to someone who's trying to quit. An addiction, right? They're slowly quitting. You can see their progress, but every once in a while, they still want to go back to their old ways. He, that's just one of the symptoms. He was there's, getting better. There's, there's a difference between having an addiction and being a psychopath. Like, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> no, he was being healed, man. He was, he he was on his way to recovery. Have, when was he being healed? Did you he see what he was doing? Let the, poor, <laughs> let the poor people get the food. When he went into public, he was waving to the poor people. He was being like, hey, what's up? Yeah. He treated Tyrion like a white guy from the 40s would treat a black guy. Like that was just dude discrimination to another nah, level. man, see, it's only to it's it, it Come on, he he's he he. You have to say he showed signs of getting better. Like come on, how? No, nah, no, you know what? Zal in season three, you're, uh, Zal was actually right. In season exactly. Three. I'm not he talking. Really about it. I'm serious. How? We in season four now, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> nah, exactly. But see, that's, that's the thing that kills me. He, I mean, he really did in season three. It looked evident like he was gonna be yeah. a nice guy, or I mean, at least nicer yeah. or more, more. Yeah, exactly. In season three, didn't he shoot a stripper like in his room with Marjorie? Well, yeah. I mean, he he. But 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 to the public, he was at least he wasn't torturing the public. Exactly. Dan, 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 Dan. Don't get me wrong. He was still a dick and a and a motherfucker, but he was getting better. He was getting better slowly. He did he did nice things. He did nice things. <laughs> What's the nice thing? What the fuck? <laughs> no, 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 no. He didn't do nice thing. No, what nice Marjorie thing? did nice thing. Okay, no, Marjorie made him do nice things. <laughs> what what did, no, 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 no. Okay, he, 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 he. All right, what Marjorie taught Joffrey was that yes, you do need to love the people. That's what Marjorie exactly. taught Joffrey. Exactly. But he did nothing. Earn the love of the people. He just followed Margie's lead. He yes. wasn't doing anything. Yes, he's following her stuff. Lead. Okay, he was the one. Okay, okay, okay. I see what you guys are trying to say. He wasn't becoming a better person. He was getting a better image in the face of the public. There's a exactly. difference. Exactly. No, okay, no, 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 no. no, 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 no. You have no Dan way. Dan did it round the You have no way of knowing, no way of knowing whether, or whether he was or he was not. <laughs> Dan, why that's, don't you come to Bankai's uh, live streams for Game of Thrones? That's some bullshit. Because Bankai does his live streams at like 1 a.m. and shit. Like, I can't talk then. Oh, for you? <laughs> Yeah. You're not. You're not in the same time zone as Bankai. I am, but like, when he starts them, it's 1 a.m. Like literally. When are, aren't his live streams like right after the episode? No, it's like an hour. He after does like a, well. He does them like three to, hours he, later. He wanted me to be in it. I asked him to give me at least an hour or so to do my own review. Yeah. See, I I do my review like right after the episode, and then. Uh, yeah, because like I got the HBO that's on. Um, yeah, I can't. Uh, your guys' that time timeline. So I'm able to watch each. I'm able to watch it at six my time, mm-hmm. and then I'm able to hop on that game. But yeah, I don't know, Joff. See, fuck you, hockey. He wasn't as bad as he was. Well, not like one a.m. I meant to say it's like it's really late, and like the fact that I don't live alone yet. I'm gonna live alone and like. I'm moving on like a month or so. That's no, gonna be yeah, a bad time. You want, you want to move in? No, I understand. I understand. Oh, I just, I mean, yeah. you, you post some, good, you post some good comments and stuff. That's why I was asking. Mm-hmm. Dan, can I move in? I, I didn't even know yeah. until the TV started getting all together. Like that. Retro? Mm-hmm. Hell no. <laughs> yeah, you with us? Yo, yo, hockey, hockey. You wanna, you wanna join in too, bro? Yeah. <laughs> It'll be me, you, Dan, and Retro in a four by four apartment. I am not living with Zalden. What the fuck? You think it's Four by four. <laughs> I, I would, I would never out. room with Alvin. After what you told us in that Skype call, what you did with your roommate. Yo, chill, bro. I'm yeah, not going to say what you did. would kill everyone in the apartment. If you hey, Violin. Yo, I'll, I'll be in my room like laughing at like a like an anime episode. Yo, like, if Dan's playing League, can be, be like, Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, <laughs> this guy's... You guys will want to kill me because I snore really loud. Like, Oh, yeah, Dan does snore. Oh, yeah, he does. He does snore. <laughs> 
I, mean, I like how you guys. I like how you guys know us so loud because I fucking fall asleep in Skype calls. Nah, <laughs> <laughs> you fall asleep. Yo, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You don't. You know, I, mean, I didn't even say this on live, but you know how many times when we used to have, I used to have late night Skype, uh, Skype calls with like Norton Thomas, Barnkind, and Justin. Norton Thomas would always yeah. fucking fall asleep and. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it's like a tiger. Just like, you, you snore like, loud. That means you you wouldn't hear when I'm like you wouldn't wake up when I'm like stealing your shit. So. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, Zal Zal didn't got sticky fingers. He'd be what would you steal? <laughs> yeah. Yo, I, I go in dance room. I get that five finger discount real quick. <laughs> For what? <laughs> I'll steal your subway sandwich from the refrigerator. <laughs> they wake up with frozen food, man. <laughs> Oh yeah, Zal, I heard you were making sure you had to kill him or something. Wait, what, what'd, you you say, what'd, you what'd you say, Rick? What'd you say? I said I heard your roommate ate your food or something, you were hella mad. Yeah, he, he uh, see, like, like it, it's so hard to tell when someone eats your food, especially when you're not one of those people that, like, checks every day, like, how much they have. But, like, I had this one, I had this, uh, what was it? I had, like, like cookie, and I had, like, uh... What's it called? Okay, it was like cookies. It was like a, a box of like Fun Dip. And it was like a box of, uh, like, you know those boxes of bags of chips and shit? Yeah, yeah but I know you eat like any real big, food? Uh, yeah, no. I, dude, I only no. eat jumbo. No, he doesn't. He doesn't. <laughs> this guy, I, this guy's got a picture, and he said he would grow up. In, in his shopping car, it was like snacks. That's not groceries, man. That's snack. Yeah, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, like I was saying, I have these, I have these things, right? And and I did, I literally did not eat any of any of those. And I came home one day, and I'm not the kind of person that's like all like overprotective my stuff. So I like, I just go over to where my stuff is. I look, you were like, oh and hell no, everything, nah. everything's fucking gone. Like, there's like one bag of chips left. There's like literally zero fun dips left in the box of, of like fifty. There's like no co there's like two cookies left. I'm like, what the fuck? I didn't eat any of this shit. Like, what's, hey, what's going on? At least on? they saved you. At least they saved you some. <laughs> and also, when I went shopping, I told this mother this motherfucker's like, pick me up some shit. And I picked him up like uh, like five things. And he and I'm like, yo, you gotta pay me. You're paying me. He's like, I'll pay you back. This, to this day, this motherfucker hasn't paid me back for my for the shit I got him. <laughs> Yo, I'm I didn't, like, dude, I didn't, I didn't know like my Ryan. roommate. My roommate, he got drunk. Look, yeah. look, my roommate got drunk one night, and he he was playing my PS3, yeah. and he lost on Mortal Kombat, and he broke my, he smashed my controller. Oh my god! I was so fucking pissed. See, so, at that at that like, moment, we're not like, friends anymore. And this motherfucker didn't even replace the shit. Like he didn't even give me the money back. I was hella mad. That's that's this 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 some this year is why I'm never living in a dorm again after this year. Never, never in my life. Just go. Just use a single dorm, man. You don't have to. I've had the worst dorm. ever experience with a person in my life living in a fucking dorm. No. Fuck that shit. Just do a single. Eating my food. Fuck yeah, it. Do they have single dorms? Isn't it by random though? Or you can actually. I'm just, moving, I'm just moving into an apartment. Fuck dorms, dude. I'm do I'm over dorms. Fuck that shit. Damn, Zal, they got money like that, man. Dorms are cheaper than apartments, bro. Really? No, they're not. What? Dude, you don't have to pay for electricity or like water. Apartments oh, are no, cheaper. No, sorry, you don't have to do that for apartments either. Oh, Dan, you on drugs, dude? <laughs> But yo, uh, I didn't know Brian's. Uh, I don't know. I've never, I've never, I've never lived in a dorm. But, Apartments but, are cheaper because in in dorms they you have to. Utilities are motherfucker. You know. In you dorms, you're paying for convenience. You're like closer to campus. You pay for that. And with apartments, you don't pay for convenience. It, it's just like you just pay to live there. My 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 no life. I mean. But yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. People don't steal my food. Oh yeah, Dan. Dude. Just move what I started doing, Dan. Mm. Yo, I feel like the most ghetto person ever. But what I started doing, I've done it at least since since I told you about that the other day. I've done it at least five times. I go to the the, the meal plan place. I take like two liter bottles, like empty two liter bottles, <laughs> and just fill that shit up with soda, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> I just 
I hold it under the soda dispenser and I just fucking fill that shit up. I, I come there with like four of them and I just fill them all up and I just leave. That's and honestly then, some hood rat shit. Like, <laughs> yo, wow. yo, I'm not done. I'm not done yet, Dan. And then I pour it from when I get back to my place. I pour it from the two liter bottles into like separate um, empty water bottles. And then I go back and I fill the two liter <laughs> bottles up again. Oh my god! You, you ghetto, bro. <laughs> Well, and then I'm done, and I do that again every day. I do, I literally do it every day now, every day. I've done that before at McDonald's, but they kicked me out. They kicked you out? Yeah. Because yeah. <laughs> if you don't, if you don't buy like the cup, you can't fill anything. Obviously, I'm like, fuck you guys, I'm thirsty. I took out like a water bottle and <laughs> started filling it up, and he smacked <laughs> it out of my hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Damn. I was fucking thirsty. I, I got a question for everyone here. Like, I'm not saying I'm done. I'm not saying I've done it. But tell me the truth, guys. Has anyone ever got a water cup and filled it with soda? Of course. Yeah. <laughs> what um, do you mean water I'm cup? Talking. Like you ask for like a uh, you give them a cup. Like you ask for a cup. You know, you know what though? Because you know what? Because like the the water at in McDonald's, the dispenser, it's usually connected to like the high seal of lemonade. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah that yeah, weird yeah. mixed taste. So like hell no, you ain't gonna tease with no little vague lemonade taste. Oh, no, the water cup oh. is so small. I take out my own water bottle, dude. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. Yo, every What's time I go to Chipotle, I'm like, yo, can I get a water cup? They give me a water cup. I feel like shit with soda every fucking time. Dude. <laughs> <It's so small. laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm coming clean right now. I'm coming clean. <laughs> I think the FBI. You better, you better hope no Chipotle uh, employees are uh, watching the stream, though. Then. Um. Yo, I'm, I'm gonna come clean about everything bad I've ever done in my life right now on the street. Alright, um, one time, I was at uh, Publix, the deli. It's like a deli, and you go, basically, you go inside the store and you order a sub, and then you go to the cashier, you pay for it, and you leave. This is one time. This was a complete accident. Because. Yeah, yeah, no, I already see what it's going I swear, I I swear it was an accident. I swear it was an accident. Because my mom was coming to pick me up. That was this was like seven years ago. My mom was coming to pick me up. It was a complete accident, bro. So I got my sub and I was on my way to the cashier and my mom calls me on my phone and she yells, she's like, Where the hell are you? I'm like, Oh shit. So I like run outside and I get in the car and then I then then I, I remember I'm like, Oh shit. I didn't pay for my sub. Did you pay or did you leave? Alright, I'm 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 coming clean about everything in my life. Did you pay for it, or did you just dip? Nah. By the, by the time I realized it, I was already halfway home. I was like, shit. <laughs> I, I've done that before, but, like, at my Dan, high school cafeteria. Dan can, Dan, can you at least come clean, too? Like, and, am I well, alone? There's too many instances of, like, name, like, individual ones. Like, I would just take, like, a slice of pizza and leave. Dan, we're, we're gonna, Dan. <laughs> Yo, Dan, the beat strikes story. again. We're going to go story for story coming clean, Dan. We got to do this. You got to help me out. <laughs> you don't have enough for me, dude. <laughs> I do. I trust my people. <laughs> go, 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 go. Oh, my God. Go. All right, I'll, I'll go. come clean. I, I used to movie hop all the damn time when I was a kid. Oh, no, Rick. All right. <laughs> I thought dude, I, was dude, I used awesome. to, like, yeah, there was, like, one time I spent literally, I spent literally the entire day <laughs> movie hopping. <laughs> Yo. Like, I've done that Rick went home, and he made a review for every movie out. <laughs> <laughs> That's a Bronchi type of shit right there. Alright, Dan, go. You know, it's a shit. Like, to review everything he reads. Well, Dan, well go. I movie hot, but he already said that. Um, I once taken candy, like, you know how, like, uh, uh, like people have backpacks and on the side they'd have, like, a little holster thing? Yeah. There's no zip or anything. It's just exposed. This guy had, like, a bag of Skittles and, a, like, a Snickers bar. Like, I just walked by him. I pretend to bump into him. I'm like, oh, sorry. I oh, <laughs> I damn. Oh, damn. I lifted, I lifted my shirt up. I put it Dan under my like shirt. like, one of those, like, old-time pickpockets and, like, Oliver Twist. Like, they bump, <laughs> into, you. They bump into you and then all your shit is gone. <laughs> I lifted my shirt. I put it under my shirt and then just walked away. <laughs> all right, so I got another one to come clean for. So one time what I did I'm sorry uh, I'm sorry I, I w this was a long time ago I was I was a I was a different person so I went to, to the grocery store <laughs> and I bought I think I bought like two boxes of pop tarts and what I did was I went back around like I bought them and I went back around and I put 
another box of Pop Tarts in my bag, and then I left. Oh, that's nothing. Bro. That's I'm soft. Sorry. This is another one. That was nothing. Go ahead, Rick. Your turn. You're up. Uh, all right. Uh, fuck. All right. All right. This, this is, is terrible. 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 <laughs> terrible. So, so, so when I when I was when I, when I, when I was homeless, mm-hmm. I had my sister. I had my sister, and we had no money, mm-hmm. and she was hungry. So what we did was, we went through the exit door of of uh, hometown buffet so we could get some food. And we so basically we snuck in the hometown. What's up, buffet. bitches? Damn, I wish I could do that. Damn. <coughs> I don't even know what hometown buffet is. Yeah. It's, you know, it's basically, well, it's a buffet. That's what it is. <laughs> I mean, yeah. It's it's really good actually. I like so it. So you just snuck in. So sad. All right. Oh, so, so yo, Shiraz, Shiraz, you there? Is he? Is he there? If he's not, he needs to get the boot. He joined, but... He just joined. <laughs> We're doing confessions. Okay, Dan, go ahead. Dan, go ahead. It's your, it's your turn. Um, I don't know, man. I took some shit from Wonderland. <laughs> oh, when, 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 when? Are you okay? I'll, I'll tell another one. I'll, I'll tell another one. In kindergarten, um, I didn't know what I was doing. I literally had no fucking clue what I was doing, but we were in the lunch line. And how the lunch line worked at our school is they give you your food, and then you you get to the part of the lunch line. They have like bags of chips and like, gummy bears and like all kinds of shit, and, like, drinks. So the kid in front of me, like I didn't even know this kid, but he took gummy bears and he put them underneath his hamburger. So the hamburger, <laughs> was, like, the hamburger was like <laughs> on top of the gummy bears. That's a new age signal that, that that he wants to be. So I was there behind him, and I'm like, oh, shit, this is smart. But I didn't, like, I don't know. I guess I was too dumb to know that he was stealing it. So I did it while I was literally right in front of the lunch lady. Like, literally right in front of her, I was just like, yo, let me just put this under real quick. And she's like, what what are you doing? And she just took it, and I was like, shit. (laughs) That's horrible. (laughs) See, I've uh, never been caught. Rick, Rick, you're up, man. Confessions, bro. Yeah, Zaladin, I was listening to you, but I was eating, so I couldn't reply. Oh, okay. No, no, no. I was just asking if you have any uh, confessions to make, man. We're coming clean here. All right. What do you want me to confess about? Anything in particular? Because there's a anything lot of... Bad, uh, anything bad you've done in your life. Oh, <laughs> uh, well... We're letting out our, our negative uh, zen right now. Ah, uh, man. Okay, so last last winter, it was, it was Christmas Eve, mm-hmm. and I wanted to get some wings. So I was walking down my block to the Chinese spot, and I saw these these people that I don't like, and their house was like dressed up OD. <laughs> they had those inflatable snowmen. I said, oh, I, I I remember this shit. Yeah. They had they had nice flower pots and 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 yo, they had every <laughs> ornament. They had Dora Christmas set up boots. I took all of that shit down, bro. Slashed oh. everything up. But oh. I felt. I destroyed the flower pot. I, I, I can't out. wait to see here the things out uh, Shiraz has done. He's probably like destroyed. Damn, Shiraz, this is crazy. Go, 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 go. Yo, I felt, Grand I felt, planes I felt, in the I felt, buildings. Yo, man, I felt bad, and the next day I wanted to put a $20 in, the, in, the, in, a, in their fucking mailbox. Wait, I was so like, why, man, I fucked that shit. Why did you destroy their house? Oh, because <laughs> um, they're, the, the lady that lives there, she's racist, and she beat up some girl for no reason. Oh, okay. And it was my homegirl, so I got pissed. I was like, yo, man. Shiraz was getting the revenge. Shiraz, uh, young Sasuke. <laughs> yeah, man. That's how I gained my mangeku. But I, I uh, <laughs> to this day, I, I regret it. Because uh-huh. it was fucking stupid. And I'll yeah. never do something like that again. Damn. Right. Okay, uh, Rick, you're, you're up, bro. Um, what are the bad things that I've done? Um... Um. Oh. <laughs> so when I when I was a kid, I I I, I was you know the, I was friends with these badass kids. <laughs> like Dan Master. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Dan Master. Dan Master reminds me of Ichigo. <laughs> Anyways, we, we 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 broke into the into the uh, into the school. Don't pay me that faggot. <laughs> <laughs> you broke into your school? 
Yeah. Yo, that's like the last place you want to break into, but go ahead. Yeah, we broke into the school and just did stupid shit. Like, and I, I got, I actually got into a lot of trouble. Damn. I've never done anything like that. Oh, Dan, go, Dan, go ahead. I remember something. Uh, it's probably the meanest thing I've done. Um, it's like, uh, <laughs> I don't want to say it. Like, all right, w these these um, kids were playing basketball, right? They're they're like they're like two years younger than me. I was like in like ninth grade at the time. They're, I, I walk with them. I'm like, yo, let me see that ball. Can I can I take a shot? They're like, yeah, sure. They gave it to me, and I walked away. I'm like, alright, thank you. <laughs> just walk away. Yo, Dan is like a legit. Yeah, like, they, they didn't chase after you or anything. They're like, give my ball, motherfucker, or anything. No, they they, they didn't do anything. Yo, Dan, wait, Damn, wait, 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 Dan, wait, wait, Dan put the fear of God in him. Was like, don't fuck with me, bro. I got. Wait, this. wait, Dan, did you really do this, bro? <laughs> Dan, do you just like like taking shit from people? Like, Jesus. Yo, bro, Dan, I, you bully, bro. There was like, like there was like three years Dan, when I was just. Dan, like, the bully. Person. Yo, Dan, bro, that's some mess. That's fucked up. All right. Yo, I, I'm, 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 I'm gonna post Dan's theme song. Yo, right. like Zelda. I think <laughs> that, me. Dan's, yo, Dan's like the main character from Beals Above and shit. Like, god damn. No, from from the eighth to eleventh grade, I was just like an angry person. Yo, okay. So like, how you like? How you like? You're angry and late. Mine's not even. Mine's not even. My mine's not even. Uh, that okay. Fine, fine. Dan, since you told something like that, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna post something like that. But right. let me just say, this does not reflect my character, all right? This was like a one-time thing. It was like I just remember the worst thing I've ever done in my life. Okay, go. Actually, I'm going to tell two stories in one, actually. Okay. This this was, I, I took in, in middle school, I, like uh, seventh grade or sixth grade, I took piano class in middle school. Mm -hmm. So, um, all right, let me tell the, the first one. There was this one Asian kid in my class. I'm actually, like, he's actually one of my good friends right now. But, um, there's this Asian kid named, named David in my class. And he was like the he played piano like a fucking god, right? And he had this big ass folder, like like a thick ass folder filled with music sheets. And I t okay, so while he was playing, like I took this shit, I fucking took it to the back of the classroom, and I fucking dumped everything on the floor. I don't know why I did this, bro. <laughs> but yeah. Wait, wait, sorry, I wasn't paying attention. What'd you do? I took his his folder full of music, like it was a thick ass folder of music. And I poured every sheet on the floor. <laughs> so he, he was there for like I swear he's there for like an hour picking it up. I, I don't know why I did it, bro. That, that was that was some fucked up shit, but um, that sounds funny. So another thing I did is there was another girl. Um, I think it was my ex. I was in that class, and she was about to sit at her uh, piano. She was like about to sit on the stool, and I took the stool and I pulled it out from under her. And she like, and I didn't pull it out far enough, so she just fell and like her head hit the stool. <laughs> <laughs> dude, that's not funny, dude. <laughs> it is. Yo, I, this is like the bad shit you've done. Like what oh, the hell? I, I've done shit like that to my like, hit, her, It was it was a girl. Her head hit the back of the stool, and like she wasn't like crying, but like a tear came out. Like, oh, bro. me and my boys would do that all the time. When someone goes to sit down, you just pull that shit up from under. Yeah, I kicked the chair. I kicked, I, kicked, I kicked the chair of my friend. And, like, Dude, you know, Dan like, is like, okay, so here's how I rate this. Dan is like a real, like, bad villain. Like, like Dan is like Frieza. <laughs> yeah. Dan is like Frieza. Rick is like justified villain. <laughs> And Shiraz is like an anti-hero. Like Shiraz does it for like revenge. Yo, Zell, you're not asking what I'm doing. Like what I do. Damn. No, what what happened? You have some good stories. Uh, no, I'm doing. Well, you're the one of them. Stories. All right, all right. So, so this is our order. We're going me, Shiraz, Rick, Retro. I don't know if hockey has any, but after hockey, it's bad. No, no. Nah, I know hockey got some fucked up shit. I know hockey. Rick, Hockey, Hockey is this. You something. have anything? I have different. an angel. What are y'all talking about? <laughs> you have anything worse than dance? I, I don't, I don't, Hockey I, has I, I don't want to do some soul. I have one worse than what I just said, but I don't want to say it. Oh, like, wait, Dan, you're bad. saying it this round, bro. Okay, Shiraz, go. Shiraz. <laughs> <laughs> Man, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? We're, we're just talking about the same shit, confessions, but we're, 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 we're making them worse. We're making them bad now. Confessions. Uh, you want to talk about something real bad? It's the shit that you regret and you wish you never did, but you know you did it. Oh man, I remember there was this. I was like, I was like, 
I was mad young when this happened. I was probably like 13. This is mad long ago. But, uh, this, my cousin's parents used to babysit this kid, and I think he had, like, Down syndrome or something, because something was wrong with this motherfucker. And I don't know, I don't know what this guy did to, to piss me off, but he, he did something. It was really long ago. And I beat him up really bad, and I stepped on his chest and shit, and I, I thought, I thought he was gonna die. Damn! Yeah. Oh, dude, yeah, when you step on someone's chest, they're usually going to die. Yeah, I was like 13 back then, and he was oh, like 12. Shit. No, well, sure no, sure no, 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 seriously, like, no, if you beat, like, if you fight someone, and you kick them while they're down, that's considered attempted murder. No, no, she, he wasn't, he wasn't, like, in, in, the, in, a, in a very bad situation. I'm just over-exaggerating. Yeah. He was like, he was like, he was crying, but then after, like, after, after I punched him in the stomach, he, he stopped crying because it was hard for him to breathe. And then that's what I said. <laughs> yo, Shiraz punched him to make him stop crying. <laughs> I was, yo, we was mad young, yo. He was 12, I was 13. Shiraz was like, I can't remember what happened, but I, I, I still feel but bad about that. Yo, these stories are getting to World Star, like slowly working to World Star level. <laughs> Alright, so uh, Shiraz almost killed somebody. Alright, Rick. <laughs> fuck. Alright, uh, fuck. Alright, I'm gonna tell you a story of how I got my my copy of Kingdom, the first Kingdom Hearts game. So I was working at the movie theaters. Look, 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 I was working at the movie theaters, and you know it was the day before my birthday. I was like, all right, I know I'm gonna get Kingdom, I'm gonna get Kingdom Hearts for myself for my birthday. Well, come to find out, there was a brand new, in the Lost and Found. I took that shit. Damn. Damn. Oh, Rick, Rick getting it. Rick getting I'm, it. Getting my, I'm getting my game. I used to steal shit from the Lost and Found all the time, dude. All right, so, so Dan, wait for your turn, bro. Um, Retro, go ahead. See, see if you can top your the story. Well, you guys already know about the time when I jumped the guy. No, Retro, tell the story. Retell it, retell it, retell it. Oh. Oh, the whole story? Yeah. Okay. So, right. basically, the guy, Joe, Joe Hardy, right? The guy? You guys probably remember his name. Like he was making fun of like this disabled kid for no reason, like lunch. Like and he always made some stupid ass shit. Like he would come to my lunch table and say, "Dude, I got my dick sucked from my, from my dog suck. Put peanut butter on it." I'm like what the fuck is this guy talking about? And like and he said, "Um, dude, I think my mom's so hot. I wanna fuck my mom." I'm like what the fuck's wrong with you? <laughs> what the hell? And then like he lived close by, right? So me and my friends invited him to play a, a game of football. And then after we like we play a little bit, right? We take him to the garage. It was like dark. It was like eleven o'clock at night, right? And oh my some God. of my friends were hiding in that, and we just beat the fuck up. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> so, <laughs> fucking retro. Retro, Ooh. retro is slowly working its way down to Dan Master. You see, you see I didn't, I didn't do it that badly. No, I'm waiting, I'm waiting for the retro story yeah. about how he killed someone over a volleyball game. See, see, the reason why that's sadistic is because he lured him in by playing football. He <laughs> lured him in. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, there yeah. wasn't any really marks on this little kid back when we had that, that thing. No. <laughs> you know, <laughs> friend, we'll play football. Like so he beat his ass. Like, Yo, get this out of my fridge. Bam. Retro's doing like some professional villain shit. Like he had his goons hiding in the shadows. <laughs> his goons were hiding in the Yo, when the when the kid stepped into Retro's garage, Retro's like, yes, yeah, it's all according to my plan. Like Hey guys. He was like he was like Eisen <laughs> pretending to be everyone's friend. You you know retro did, some... did you make him suck the strap? That's the real question. <laughs> <laughs> you know retro did some shit like retro retro like shouted all out going according to plan. Retro shouted out now and all all his guys jumped out. Get him. Get him. All right, so uh, Dan, go ahead, man. Dan, tell tell about the time you you stole from that dude. No, Re okay, retro's I, I, one I thought... of the troll villains, man. He's like all right. going according. I'm, He's like, I'm gonna, I've been watching you since you were born. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to say three, and then I'm done. I don't want to say any more than that, okay? One is when I bashed this guy's head against the table because he was pissing me off. It was like, we were supposed to be like, we are reading something, right? It was like a, a pamphlet that a teacher gave out we were supposed to be reading, and this guy kept pissing me off. He kept like making fart noises. I'm like, yo, shut up. He's like, no, why do you want me to shut up? And he kept like poking me and shit. 
And it, he's doing this for like 10 minutes. I'm like, you know what? I grab the back of his head. I smash his head against the desk. I'm like, shut the fuck up as loud as I could. Yo! <laughs> yo, that's what he did to Savage. Damn. <laughs> Damn. All right, what, what, and then what, what happened was his braces were fucked up. But like, that, that's irrelevant. Damn. Um, the other one is I made a teacher cry because <laughs> oh my god it was it was a it was a temp teacher right and then like like the, this dude was really annoying so I'm like you know what? fuck you he he went up to write something on the chalkboard and I was like on the second row so he wouldn't expect me I kept running up smacking his papers <laughs> on the ground and went right back <laughs> he got I did this like five times he got so mad and then he turned around to write again and I shot a spitball at like at the back of his head. And then he just sat down. He's like, I'm not teaching you guys anymore. And he just sat down and started crying. <laughs> Dan is like, fucked up. Yo, okay, what's the last one? Oh, no, this one ruined my reputation, dude. <laughs> Yo, we, we're all telling confessions. Come on, bro. All right, all right. Yo, Zalada, you're the one who's orchestrating this performance. Why don't you confess? <laughs> I, I have confessed a, a few things, but Dan, go ahead. I'm, I'm, I'm next. I'm after Dan. This is this is my last story. Rob like, is like the hype man at every fight. Okay. Like, Yo, okay. punch him, punch him harder. It was it was Halloween, okay, and like we we were like in like the ninth grade, and like it was like I was hanging out with a bunch of people I didn't know, but like they're all like like thugs or whatever at my school. So I'm like, I right, whatever, we'll go around Halloween, get candy, whatever. But they don't they wanted to rob people for their candy, and not even just people, little kids. And then, <laughs> and then they kept robbing people one by one. Like, all right, yo, Dan, you got the next one. I'm like, <laughs> like I don't, I'm like, what do you mean I got the next one? I'm like, I, I was pretty much peer pressured to walk up to this little fat white kid. I'm like, yo, you know what's going to happen right now, right? <laughs> and empty <and> your bag. <laughs> he's, like, he's like, oh, no, I'm getting robbed. <laughs> he's, like, he's, like, he's like, are you really going to rob me? That's how small I am. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, yo, bro. Yeah, that's mean. I'm like, don't make this harder than it has to be. <laughs> just empty this bag. And, and I'm really questioning you. Bro, I'm Dude, telling you, from the 8th to 11th grade, because my parents got divorced, I was just an angry fucking kid. Like, oh, I Dan, used to pick like, fights Dan, all the time. Dan, so you stole his candy? Yeah, and then I walked away. <laughs> oh, oh, my God, yo. I'm telling you, Dan is Dan is basically freezing, bro. Holy shit! All right, uh, Ray, you got any confessions, man? Of Anything what? you want to get off your chest? Of what? Anything you want to get off your chest? Bad things you've done in your life that you want to come clean? Oh, last week I went to this um like Hispanic restaurant. <clears throat> I ordered a burger, took a bite. There was a fucking spider in it. Wait, 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 wait. Question, you though. went to a Hispanic restaurant and ordered a burger. Well, that was your first problem. You went to a Hispanic why, why restaurant. Would, why would you confess for that? It's not your fault. Um, like, what have you done? Maybe that's bad? I, have you done anything bad? Uh, I did it bad. Yeah, like, just like something you were mm. growing up. Like how, you, how you I sold defective see. games to customers and stuff. <laughs> oh, um, yeah, I guess that was that was basically it. Um. So you didn't do anything bad ever? Hold on. You know, um, two weeks ago, or a week ago, we decided to go to the lakefront. And, you know, it was like a family get-together, and there was some of the neighbors. And there's like, this nine-year-old kid I can't fucking stand. So I would purposely wait until no one was around so I can push him and just be the biggest dick I could. I remember we were playing volleyball, and I would purposely make it apparent to smack him in the face with the ball as many times as I could. Damn. I did not like that kid. Those ones were, like, I purposely aimed the soccer ball because I knew it would hit him. Like, this little kid was so annoying because I, I was working on a paper. Damn. And, you know, I had my laptop there. I told him, like, no one go to my room working on his paper for school. So he walks in there and purposely just spills a whole fuck ton of water on my laptop to fuck it up. So since that day, I used that kid as, like, my, you know, public, like, punching bag. I just don't like him. Every time I see him, I push him off his bike. I hit him with a ball. Or I do whatever I can. Damn. Oh, shit, yo. Dude. He ruined one of my final papers. Like it was like a, a six-page paper I had worked. I'd done like four and a half pages, right? I was almost, I was close to being done. And he just goes and just fucking throws water in it. So I just do whatever I can to piss the kid off now. All right, so I'm gonna tell some shit. My, mine, mine is not as bad as you guys because I, I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I'm not that like. Well, I think Dad is the worst out of all of us. 
I'm not about that life. Well, Dan, Dan is. I, I already told you guys. I already knew Dan is like that next level. Dan. Yeah, I had to, to stop saying because there's so many more. But I don't want to ruin myself even more than I already have. Dan, it doesn't matter, bro. Just go. Let we're all letting loose right now. Yeah, I'm. I'm the one letting loose most. <laughs> these these aren't even that bad. I don't. I don't think these are that bad. But um. Oh, I remembered another one. I was at. I was actually when you said lakefront, it reminded me. So I was at the lake with my sister. And we were, at the time, we didn't, uh, I think we were like, I, I, actually, no, 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 we both had a swim, actually. I think we were like five, and this is like a legit lake, and this is Florida, so you can't go in lakes, because there are like like alligators and shit, like you, you cannot go in a lake. Like, <laughs> so we were at a lake, me and my sister, because we used to, that's when we, I used to actually go outside and, and get fresh air and shit, but um... So she was walking like alongside the lake, like having fun, and this is like a deep ass lake too. I don't know why the fuck I did this. I just went up to her, took her head, and just pushed her in the lake, like just to her. Uh. And she, no, like I swear, she was like legit drowning in the lake, and like I had to like go get my mom, and she like came out and got her out. But um, uh, another one. Let's see. Um, oh shit! Yeah, I, I took like I don't even know if it's that bad. I took like a twenty pound weight and I threw it on her head. Oh my god! That's, That's kind of you up, you threw a twenty pound oh, weight on someone. That could do head. more damage than me stepping. What was it? Was it, was it a dumbbell or what? Well, yeah, it was. A, well, it was a bar. Uh, what's it called? Yeah, dumbbell. I think. The, the you, so, so you threw a dumbbell at someone's head. Okay, wait, wait, wait. It, okay, no, no, no. Okay, so we were arguing. We were fighting. Like, no, we were arguing. We weren't fighting. And she picked up a dictionary and threw it at me, and it hit me on the leg. So I got mad. I got mad. So I picked up this weight, and I just, it was literally, it took all my energy to throw it, but I just. <laughs> 20 pounds? Yeah, 20 pounds. <laughs> I, used all my energy, I threw it at her. It hit her right here. It just went. <laughs> how, how, how old are you? We were both little. We were like 10. So, it, it, okay, this is her. This is the weight. It went like this, and it just hit her, and she just went like a like a shown in manga. She just went flying. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> it was like uh, like Tom and Jerry or some shit. I don't know. Oh my god! <laughs> I have a point, though. I have did, did the dumbbell say acne on it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> all, I remember, all I remember is after I threw it, I was like this. I was like, oh shit! I'm so sorry. Like, Yo, You're like, I killed the bitch. <laughs> that was, um, I have a four or five year old. I can think of anything. Okay, I can't think of anything else. So, Shiraz, go ahead. Shiraz. <laughs> oh, man, me again. Uh, I gotta think. Let, let somebody else go before me. Yo, uh, Rick. Rick. Oh, man. I'm CC. That's like, I don't, I don't know what else. To do. I've never, like, attacked people on, like, unprovokedly. Like, like, so I'm walking home from work. You know, this was like, I was like 18. And I had my disman, and this dude came up behind me and tried to take my disman. So I pie faced him and slammed him on the ground. Damn. And then I just, and then I just walked away. He me. That's, that's, <laughs> not, that's not your fault. You were attacked. <laughs> what the fuck is this? See, I, like I said, I don't like. I, I don't. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm trying to. Do it, but <laughs> what the fuck I'm is not this? A person, at least I try not to do. Can I just say that photoshopping is horrible? <laughs> Oh, you saw, did you see that's that? That's the comment. That's the comment for that picture, Dan. Oh, wait, Dan, I don't Dan, know what, are you I don't doing know what it is. No, I'm not in the J room. Did you make that? Did you make that? No, you didn't. Someone else did. Yo, oh my man. god. I got, I got another fucked up story to share with you guys, but it wasn't it wasn't me who did it. It was somebody else who did it, but I was just like in on it. So back in, back in sophomore year of high school, there was this teacher who always used to piss me and my friends off. So one of my friends was he was he was a sexually frustrated person. Keep that in mind. And uh, well, we just we just hated the teacher in general. So he, he used to do some some fucked up shit to her. But the most fucked up thing that he did to her that all of us knew about is like everybody went for lunch, and then we came back upstairs and we waited outside the classroom. Oh, he went inside the classroom and he jerked off on her desk. What? <laughs> and he busted, he busted <laughs> up on her desk and it's out of her, her bag. Speaking, speaking to people jacking off. Okay, okay. Right. Speaking to people jacking off. This fucker. 
this fucker named Cole last year, he was a senior last year, he fucking jacked off in the middle of class. In the middle of class. Okay, Rick, it's probably a fetish. He probably Rick doesn't who want hasn't to be tried proud. to jack off in the middle of class. Nope. <laughs> what? That's not funny, but I know, I know, like I, I have, I didn't, it wasn't my class, but I heard about a kid that did that in like a class, and okay, like I knew the I'm kid. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Um, one time wow, he I drunk, so bored. He drunk off for revenge. It was so bored. During, <laughs> <laughs> I was so bored. It was after a test where you're not allowed to speak or anything that I was just like, I was like, I wonder if I can jerk off right now. And I did for like 20 seconds. I'm like, nah, I can't. No, that's, that's nasty. Terrible, dude. That's nasty. <laughs> that's just no, that, that's that's the first people's minds now. Like in and class. Like, Dick, calm down, damn. No, that's just. That's I, didn't, just <laughs> I didn't like. Whip, I didn't like whip it out and start jerking off. I was like in private. I was like in my own clothes, but. You know. That's just that's insanitary, so, dude. Yeah, that's fucking. Yo, weird. Dan, Dan, shut the fuck up. You stole bat. You stole basketball from little kids. You stole their kids. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Dan, 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 Dan used to be a bully. Retro, retro, retro. What's your confession? No, what's your confession, retro? Um, I can't think of anything right now. Are you guys really out? Like, I don't um, have that many fucking stories, dude. Yeah, Dan, you, do you have, have any more? Or you're out. I have none. I had so many more, but I forgot them. Uh, Wait, who? Anyone who has it, go ahead. I'm uh, trying to think remember, of something. I threw my four-year-old uh, neighbor's kid into a pool and forgot about him for a couple seconds. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh, I um, I had a. Uh, it was after school in, in uh, high school, freshman year. And in the auditorium, I saw these two fat people having sex, and I almost <laughs> dropped. I, I had a, a confession. I, That's not a confession. It's, oh, I don't, I don't have a confession, but it's like a really funny story. Like I have, I, have a con, I have an actual confession. All right, go. All right, so this is actually a really bad one, if, like if you think about it. But well, whatever. So. It was, I was uh, fairly small. Me and my cousin were jumping. It was we have we uh we used to have a guest room in my house. So we were in the guest room. We were jumping on the bed like me, my like three other cousins, and my little cousin. He's a, the only cousin that was a guy. He was like beside me, and he was like he used to like copy everything I did because he was a, like he was little, so he used to copy everything I did. And I was little too, but I just got sick of this kid copying everything I fucking did. I just got really mad at him. So I pushed him while he was jumping on the bed. I pushed him off, and he was like fairly small. And we had, you know, those glass coffee tables. Yeah. He literally fell head first through the glass part. Oh my and, like, god! Like it shattered, and he was just like he went head first down. But like the weird thing is, like he just got up like nothing happened, and he just walked away. <laughs> Yo, Zal, let's play league. <laughs> What? Yo, me and Krug are playing. Me and Krug are playing right now. You guys want to play League? Yeah, man. I'll play if we get like four or five people, but I'm about to go to sleep. Yo, did you see the post? Yeah, I'll get one game. I didn't see that one, though. He's like, he's like, damn master, it's fucked up. I unsubbed from him. <laughs> oh, my God. What? He's like, he's not a cool individual. <laughs> damn. Wait, yo, Dan, blink the, uh... The comment section in the group chat? Uh, what group chat? For a Klondike bar. The, the Google Plus group chat. I got you, hang on. Mm -hmm. Alright, thanks. Yo, Dan, what the hell? Yo, what is this, Dan? <laughs> Yo, look at this picture. Oh, Dan, what the fuck is this? What picture? Look, 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 yeah. Someone put, someone posted that. Oh what my god. <laughs> wow. Dude, that's an old ass <laughs> picture. Why do I have headphones on? Yo. Yo. <laughs> Who made that? Yo, Dan. <laughs> Someone unsubbed from you. I don't care, bro. <laughs> I know I saw it. was Wacky Slice. I commented on it. I said, fuck that damn master guy. <laughs> Yo, Dan. Uh, yeah. Dan. Guys, Dan is not black. He's mulatto. <laughs> Dan is not black. He's, he's the same heritage as Baka. It's, al it's always me. See, you all said some fucked up shit, but there's going to be memes of me. Oh, nah, this. nah, none of us said anything that on the level. Dan, like right? Dan, you did like some, like some, like some. I, I'm gonna say like some bullshit type shit. Like you're one of those villains that's not justified at all. <laughs> not even a villain. You're just a criminal. <laughs> Yo, Dan. <laughs> we, we were talking. Dan, about Dan stuff. is the Joker. He just does shit to watch it all burn. We, we were talking about stuff that we regretted 
in like in our lives, and I regret all those things. Yeah, I, 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 I fucked yeah, up. That's true, that's true. Okay, I'm gonna but say this. Not criminal. I'm gonna say this real quick. <laughs> I I igno- I thank Dan for for actually Aaron. telling real confessions because I have a feeling that a lot of you motherfuckers are, are have shit that you did that you don't want to tell. That's true. That's I, very honestly, true. I really don't. I don't want to tell you. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I think each and every one of you guys have something that you did that you don't want to say. Definitely. Damn right. Damn right. Damn right I do. But for one, is live. I ain't telling you shit. <laughs> yeah. Dan, 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 put it all on the table. I, I, I thank you. Thank you for that. I have nothing to hide. What the fuck? Yeah. The only thing bad I've ever done is slam some kids' fingers in the door, but that's about it. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> that was really nice. Fuck no. Little kids. So. <laughs> I'm getting written up for talking in class. That's all I would do. I would talk a lot in class and get teachers get mad. You you know. guys are <laughs> some <laughs> like Andy. Well, I got into a lot of fights, but those aren't regrets. Like, those are just fights. You guys are some damn criminals. Damn I know. criminals. Um, I'm so evil. Watch oh, yeah, the funny story uh, I was hockey, say. I know hockey got. Like, hockey has shattered soul. Like, I know Yo, hockey is broken people. He even killed them. Hockey, hockey has things that would send chills no. that you find, bro. <laughs> hockey killed Domo, and I'm still very sad about that. I am not a criminal like you guys. That, that hockey has stories that would that would make your hair stand on end. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> what makes you? What makes you? <laughs> I'm curious. What makes you think you really have a story like that? I don't know, Hockey. That that one, that one, that, bastard, one man. that one karate picture where you're like this, like fuck with me. Like, <laughs> 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 no, that's that the funniest picture I ever seen, dude. What? That shit is hilarious. Yeah. So, like, look. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Like the most funny story though had to be the damn master basketball. <laughs> No, the candy story. Guy, like, hey, let me see the ball, man. Sure was funny. Yo, I don't think the candy story was funny, yo. That is just fucked up, dude. Which God. which one was the candy one? Oh, no, 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 no. If y'all talking about funny stories, then then I don't mind sharing that. But when it comes to confessions, fuck that shit. We, we were we were we were coming clean about things we've done that we're not not proud of. Well, I ain't coming clean for shit. I know exactly what I did. Do I regret most of them? Probably not. <laughs> All right, let, let's do let's do let's do this then. What guilty pleasures? The guilty pleasures. Um, like so, so you want basically you want to know our fetishes? Oh, I have a foot fetish. Oh. <laughs> yeah, me, he just came right out with it too. Yeah. That's normal, dude. We're talking guilty, about some guilty pleasures. Shit. I'm talking about some really like clean feet, though, like some sexy feet. I'll, I'll talk to you guys later. Let's go back. Let's go back to what uh, oh Rick was talking about guilty pleasures. No, nah, I mean it doesn't be fetish. It's just like like shit like you like that you want, not necessarily are proud of. That you don't okay. tell no one. Oh, right. cuss, cussing, cussing people out. Oh, guilty pleasures. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that, that you know what? I'm not surprised by that. I'm not you know. Like I, I, just, said, you, I just like cussing people out. You shut down channels by cussing people out, man. I mean, that was one. <laughs> that was that money wasn't even my fault. That Dan's got feet, man. He shuts channels down. Guilty pleasures. Uh, sometimes I, when my roommate's not in the dorm, I go over to his bed. Nah, I'm just kidding. Smells underwear. But, um, <laughs> <laughs> I don't have any guilty pleasures actually. I don't either. I don't, think I don't so. feel guilty about any of my pleasures. I indulge. There's, yeah, none that, there's none that come to mind, honestly. I can't think of any, but I know there's like at least ten. I don't think I have anything that I wouldn't share. Besides, besides cussing people out, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I, I, I don't have a guilty pleasure. It used to be stealing, but I stopped. Oh my god. <laughs> um, I like to pick on the new guys at work. But I don't know if that's a guilty. Um, thing. I guess I used to. When okay, Wait, Ray, aren't you a manager? I guess when my or a key holder. Okay, yeah. so th- this might be a guilty pleasure. I don't know. Like when my when my sister would have friends over for a sleepover, and my sister went to sleep, I would like hit on her friends. <laughs> That's kind of normal. 
It's not really a guilty pleasure. Got, so, how, how, how is that a guilty pleasure? You just flirt with them. Yeah, you're just making No, so. it's a guilty pleasure because I wouldn't even be attracted to them. I would just hit on them because they're my sister's friends. But no, that, they're females also. I guess. <laughs> Thirsty. Hey, <laughs> Let's see what else. What else? Uh, see, like I don't feel I don't feel free to express like shit that goes on in in a live stream. Like if it was an off air hangout, then we talk about some real shit. Well, no, so that's not going to be public reference. You know, I, I've already <laughs> said enough. I've already said enough things that are. <laughs> I mean, there's yeah, stuff that's 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 can't be. I've shared. I've shared enough. I've, I've, shared enough. I've nothing else to hide. He's afraid to let it all out. In, in I, I can make a video. Like on all the shit I've done, <laughs> and it it has like twenty minutes. Not like, not like on air. So pussy ass motherfuckers. Well, some shit's first time, but you say something, Aki. You say yeah, something. Tell us about that person. Yeah, tell us about that person. Yeah, I have nothing to say. That. That's personal. Tell us what they all say, but they're actually hiding. I said the worst shit. There's like soft nah, shit. Uh, not really. Video cards and Beyblades. Like it's nothing. No, I think I'm. We were talking about still Beyblades. I got some guy fired. He's like, who hasn't taken Beyblades? Like, Rick, someone knows who I hired, and like, he didn't know the difference between like a 3DS and a regular DS, and he thought the only difference was the memory. This this guy was a real idiot, but we couldn't fire him because you know he he didn't do anything wrong. So one day I put like, fuck, a GameStop season, I'm gonna get fired. One day I made it so the account was negative by 25 bucks. Because I, I falsely moved money, and it was during his shift, and I was signed into like his thing basically. Because when you make sales, yeah, that's, that's why I say fuck on the stop, man. They hire idiots like that, bro. He thought they fucking. Like, I just want a little part time, like I just want like a little part time sixteen hour. Bro, he yeah. thought that the only difference from a three DS and a regular DS is the memory, and I'm like motherfucker. They fucking ask you on the application if you what the system you know about. It's like what the fuck. Yo, damn. Mm. Someone caught your your basketball thing on video, dude. I saw that. I saw that. <laughs> Yo. Oh my god. Holy oh, shit. That's young man, though. I was like in like the eighth grade, I think. And then a criminal activity. <laughs> no, they stole the fucking net. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, they robbed the net. <laughs> Yo, watch that video, dude. Yo, they took the whole... <laughs> they took the whole fucking thing, dude. I took a ball, not the whole fucking thing. Wait, Yo, someone made a video already? already? No, no look, man, look, I have the video. Yo, these motherfuckers took the whole hoop. Wow. Yo, they've got the video. That's grimy. <laughs> <laughs> that is grimy. They 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 live in the struggle, dude. That's a real struggle. <laughs> Damn well though. Yo, that's on some that's on some manga main struggle right there. Yo, that is so that cold is. in the deep. Yo, that is teamwork at its finest, bro. They carry that shit out as a character. Oh my god, damn. That's fucked up. That's yeah, fucked no. up. Wait, where is this video in what group? It's right mm-hmm. here. I put it in the Google Plus, bro. I put it right here in the hangout. Ah, got you. Oh my god, that, that shit made me cry. Holy shit. Yo, no, they're just like basketball court. <laughs> Bro, that's grimy, dude. That's grimy. That's mad grimy. <laughs> that's grimy. Yo, Dan, shut up, bro. <laughs> you would do the same shit. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> Dan, like back in the day, yeah, you would, huh? Yeah, you would. I, not, I, I honestly... I don't think I would have taken a net. Yeah, then if one of your friends came up to you and said, like, yo, let's steal that hoop over there, you would have been like, all right, I'm down. I, I, I wouldn't have done it for myself. I would have done it for him. <laughs> for your friend? <laughs> if he wanted a net, I'd be like, yeah, let's go. <laughs> Enough for me. Yo, I, yeah, I don't need a net. Yo, hockey. Yo, yo hockey's going to see this picture. <laughs> yo. Oh, the 10,000 punches of hipster, too. Yo, no, 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 no. Oh, this the suit, the suit. Yo, oh, I, that shit is funny. Yo, hockey stories. If he told them, they would beat Dan. This is how you know, bro. This picture right here. That's what are you how talking you know. about? <laughs> what, is that, what is that Photoshop on? Hockey stories would beat Dan by a long shot, bro. <laughs> no, they wouldn't. See, 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 Dan be fucking with all the people who be trying to make memes on. Why, 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 why am I setting the bar? 
<laughs> what the fuck? Oh, <laughs> you said some yo, jokes, yo, some crazy yo, shit. Yo, ne- next time there's a villain in an- in manga, I'm gonna be like, yo, but is he Dan level? <laughs> is he Dan level? <laughs> he really? <laughs> <laughs> the the picture's. <laughs> yo, I'm gonna make so many memes out of this picture. It's not even funny. Yo, I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna use it for every level. level. So like, let's rate let's rate the current shonen villains. Like, all right, Blackbeard is he the end no, 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 definitely no, not. No. What do you mean? Definitely not. Yo, Joff, yo, Joffrey isn't even Dan level, bro. Nah, nah, no, yo, yo I think mean? Joffrey's Dan level. John, is, what do you mean? More. Dan. It's Don. Hey, wait, Zalden, Zalden, Zalden. It ain't Dan. It's yeah. Don Flamingo, Dan level. If is who? Don Don, Don Flamingo. Dan is, 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 is a better villain than Don Flamingo. Wow. wow. That's like the you highest say that? Zaldi can give give anyone. Heard me. You heard me, dude. Dan is on that next level. I'm like, Joffrey would have beheaded oh, the kids. Oh, no, Dan, Dan is like sane in level, bro. Uh, but you know, know, I, don't, I don't know. Like, like when Dan ain't, ain't ain't like the murder of babies. It ain't Ralph. Like Joffrey did. I'm just saying, Hockey and Dan back in the day would have made like such a duo. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> they would have been. No, they. <laughs> I can't. Oh been, I, 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 I would say it. it, it is, but. <laughs> See, no. that's the problem, hockey. You literally you know, inter- nice. leave, you leave, you leave, you leave every your interpretation. No, so now what you do is, I, all we can do is no, assume no, you're no, evil. I fear what I'm Yo, can anyone else here imagine Hockey, Dan, and Retro jumping somebody? <laughs> yeah, you know? man. This, no, I would, 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 I no, 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 no. I can't say that I'm not like, it's like, like, I can't like, say that. Like, no, look, 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 it's like the Saiyan saga. Hockey's Vegeta just stand there while Dan Master's now for this being the shit out of everybody. Yeah. Uh, no, but seriously, Dan, jumping, jumping people is some bitch shit. Dan would be the muscle, <laughs> the muscle behind the operations. Nah, man, look, I had, a, I had a thing called fear, you know, when I was a kid, growing up, you know, and feared my grandmother. Nah, hockey's a lover, not a fighter. So, uh, I didn't do okay. shit bad, because I ain't trying to get my ass beat. My grandma was yeah, good. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, I, didn't, I was always a good kid, man. I, 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 I had fear. Dude, I had no choice. Like, my grandma, even though she's like 70-something, she was stronger than like my dad. Like, when she was angry, nothing. <laughs> you, you gotta have a weak you dad, know, you know we. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ray, Ray, Ray's Hispanic, man. I know he got the mask. Bro, you, you know how Hispanic. Dude, my grandma's no. the where she's like, "Mijo, to my dad, if you don't back the fuck away, I'm gonna beat the shit out of you." I'm like, "Oh shit, my grandma doesn't fuck around." Oh, we're saving, we're saving worse ass beatings for next Marvel Club episode. Hey, hey, <laughs> <laughs> uh, and here, here's all I'm gonna time. say. Here's here's all I'm gonna say. Me and Shiraz have the worst <laughs> Yeah. Me and Shiraz nah, have you know, a, see, here's the thing, here's oh, the thing. Ass. Me, 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 my, my mom, me and Zelda probably got like the same me, upbringing. Man. But she would, do. my mom never beat me, but she would cuss me the fuck out and uh, hurt my Rick, Rick, Rick. She would like, she so crush me. The country me. that me and Shiraz are from, ass beating is like an art, bro. No, <laughs> my, my, mine is worse than both of you combined. Bro. No, wow. shut the, Dan, shut Stop up. Stop not, man. Dan, Dan have, you, have, you, have you had like, like ice water poured on you while you were sleeping? Yeah. 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 I think the worst thing though, my dad, my dad, he actually threw a vacuum at me. Dan, tell me this. Nah, nah, I don't really get beat. But when I was like, when I was like 12, I think I stole from my dad. So what he did is he had me take a really like, like he he basically poured a bunch of hot water on me, and then like he made me wait outside because it was really really cold. And when I got inside and I couldn't really feel much, he beat the shit out of me with a leather belt. (laughs) No, my my sis my sister got hit with a vacuum once, bro. <laughs> so did I. No, nah, yeah, no. Like my mom and dad were were like fighting like seriously, and I got between them and I and I told my dad back up, and and he left. But then he came back and he threw a vacuum at my leg. <laughs> <laughs> like yeah. So was it the actual vacuum or like? No, I got thing? I got in he trouble. Took the vacuum, picked it up, and threw it like a spear. <laughs> at my leg. I'm not gonna lie, yo. I got in trouble once. <laughs> My my mom went out on a walk, yo. She came back with a tree branch, bro. Yeah. <laughs> she had like like a, like a jagged tree branch, and she was just like like just yo, I got. Fucked up. 
That's that's dedication. Damn, damn, I have worse stories than that, bro. Bro, I think we all have stories about. Have you ever hit like a nephew or like, you know, like a? We're talking about hitting kids. Nah, nah, I can't. Uh, my I can't, nephew, my nephew is not never? even a year old yet. Ne- never. I, look, I all right, look, all right. I, I, I have, I have. I have too. I, I feel my reason is valid. Okay, grant, grant. People say it's not, but I, I think it is. We're playing Mario Kart Double Dash. I won. He beat you, so you beat him. Cooler. And my, my, my general action was, is to sock him. Fucking dead in the fucking face. <laughs> <laughs> like now, nah, I'll think about it. I never thought about. It. Till this day, I feel like like I was justified. We, um, you might cut out. We didn't hear like what happened. What a dick. We we heard like the I, I don't know. If my mic's gonna cut off. But um, literally, all I said was, he threw my controller because he lost at the ground, oh. and I punched him. In the face. It's only Like not not holding back. I think I think that's justified. It's bro, justified. Okay, th- see, all right. Of course you would think it's justified, Dan. You're fucking criminal. No, why is it justified? No, that, that is justified because like I mean, you're, you're fucking. You're this is what the gate you. Wait, the gate you came out. Hell yeah, fucking control. No, disrespect- yeah, he disrespects your property. I mean, yeah. I would have smacked the shit out of him after I punched him. My seven-year-old cousin, um, no, he's he's no, he's about like nine now. I think it was nine when he happened. Like, you know, I think it was a few years ago. Um, it was around the time where like I think he just was trying to use swear words like everybody else. So I remember um, one time out of nowhere, like the neighbor lady's like, "Oh, how's it going?" And he's like, "Shut up, you fat bitch!" And like instinctively, I just smacked him so fucking hard. Like I felt so bad because like he flew back a little, but like. Like, it was just an instant reaction. I still feel justified, because, like, out of nowhere, he's like, shut up, you fat bitch. So, like, without thinking, I'm like, bam. And, like, I hit him really hard to the point where he felt like this was all swollen. But I think I was justified. Because, like, no, nah, you know, but here, here's the thing, though. You have to be extremely careful when you hit someone else's kid, because you don't, you don't know what no, the, no, no, no. That, that was my nephew. Like. That's to the neighbor. Well, I mean, oh, even man. if it's your nephew. Well, I, I, I got a story. I got a story. I got a story. No, my, my neighbor's cool. My nephew's cool. But I told him, like, that's how we learn not to not to swear to other people for no reason. All right, so I have my little cousin, right? Oh, well, it's not like little cousin because she's like bigger than me. But <laughs> she's she's little in the sense that like she's younger than me, but she's bigger. She's like huge. She's huge. So um, that's question level. She's fat. You can say it, man. No, she wasn't. She's not fat. Her her, her dad is like. Like almost seven, like this. Okay, no, well, he, he's really fucking tall. They, they're just tall as fuck. But um, anyways, this bitch, I forgot what she did to piss me off. But like, I know this is a bitch move. But like, uh, she did so. I forgot what the fuck did she do. I don't even remember. But like, this is the same person. I think I told Dan that I broke a globe on her. I broke a globe on her back. Like I did it. To, but anyways. Fucking, she turned around to walk away, and I don't know why I did this, but like I hit her as hard as like like I literally as hard as I could. I hit her so hard that I fell down on the back of her head. Wow. Like that was me. That's some funny shit. That's some funny stuff. But this, this, like I had like her mom's like if she does anything like bad, cause she was a bad kid though. Her mom's like if she does anything bad, you can discipline her, and I'm like all right, whatever. That was that was my discipline. That was your discipline. <laughs> I feel like I don't think I ever beat on like a kid. That's like. Dan, shut up, Dan. No, this is me being honest. Beating on a kid like a year younger than me, over a year. Sorry, I've Dan, never been on someone. Uh, you wouldn't beat them, but you'd steal their shit. This well, what has been socked? What has been socked? Beaten? Uh, no. Thousand years of history. Don't just stop beating the kid in karate. <laughs> but, I, <dude. laughs> but I was a kid back then. <laughs> nah, but there's like a... This thing is so funny. I've told... I think I've told uh, Zylan in this before. And some people that are probably in that Skype call. But like... In the process of me doing like karate... There's something else I did. And it's so fucking... Like, I always think back about this shit. Children robbing? Drugs. <laughs> no. Where the fuck? Why would I? I don't do drugs, bro. Oh. Um. 
This shit is really fucking. No, this shit is funny though. And my my karate teacher and she, like has suggested it to my grandma. So she put me and my brother in ballet, right? Ballet and tap dancing. Oh shit, dude! Oh. I'm not even gonna look. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, so you had a tutu. You had a tutu. No. <laughs> but I mean, oh my god! What I'll say is we were surrounded by a gang of bitches. So you can diss it all you want now. Nobody me. My brother kind of he was old. He was over it, but. Anyway, can't can, that shit can good balance, but tap dancing though, bro, that shit's tight. So hockey and a leotard. Oh my god! No, Please don't get hockey me. Hockey wearing he wearing sweatpants. Like so you guys can't hear me. No, we can't. No, we, can uh, hear you. No, no. we cannot hear you. What the fuck? No, <laughs> All right then, Dan. Oh, we lost the murderer. It's about that time. Uh. About that time. <laughs> Are we gonna wrap this up or? Bro, he left it. He left. You know he left to steal from yeah, me. Yeah, probably. I'm yeah, all okay. out of condoms, out then. Huh? I'm all out of condoms. You're all out of condoms. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> didn't you get the joke? Or do I gotta explain it? Because if I do, then it'll be a bad joke. Well, I know I didn't get it. I didn't get it. You said you said you want to wrap it up. I said I ain't got Whoa. no more condoms. <laughs> I want to say I want to I want to save the the child abusing comments for next stream for next <laughs> club. Child abusing? I do that yeah, all the time. I need I need your help on the. <laughs> Alex does because he works with kids. I work at a daycare so and I dodge balls at kids. It's so funny. Damn, bro. And when they're sleeping, I accidentally air quotes kick them in the head. <laughs> Holy shit! Yo, I love that, Alex. But they wake up and act like nothing happened, and then it's like, so bitch, something did happen. So basically, Alex is back because he stole the galaxy. Little kid. No, no, I found it. I found it. Found it. So now I, I have. Just, to... I can just picture like Alex pissing off a whole like school worth of like little kids or third graders, and them just beating the shit out of you. We talked about this one. Honestly, right? honestly though, like. <laughs> I still can't believe Dan's story of walking up to those ki that kid and stealing his fucking candy. Like, oh, Yo, Dan is the he's despicable. That's why. Dude, Dan, Dan, Dan's a criminal. That that is Dan. Dan like border. Dan was like borderline criminal. Okay, I'm gonna rate. I'm gonna rate everyone from most criminal to least criminal. Okay. I'm not a criminal at all. Don't even call me a criminal, man. Hockey, hockey gets number one just because he, he didn't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> Aki is the only person that can ever surpass Dan Master. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I the only one? Because, you that, you because of the picture with the suit. That convinced me enough. <laughs> yeah, that was a pretty... No, pretty Aki's uh, the person where they, they yeah. ask, like, the kid, the kid who just beat the other kid up, they're like, who's the last person he spoke to? They're like, oh, last person he spoke to before he got mad was Aki. No, I'm, I'm a mastermind, so that just makes me the worst. <laughs> Hockey, uh, hockey, sexy, you right off the deep end. All right, so I uh, set things up. Master, up. I'm sorry, Shiraz, you take the cake next. Hey, man, I'm a good person. I don't and really then, do nothing bad. Well, there's a big gap between you and Dan. You're, it's huge. You're, you're, <laughs> you're not bad. You, you don't, you don't. It was like one thing. It was like one thing. And then, it, actually, no, no, no. I put Ray above Shiraz. I put Ray first. Well, I mean, I was kicking kids. Nah, man. I, I mean, I, I, I don't mind my position. No, no, I, I got to go band level. You know how much fun it is to spike a ball? Ray, I spy, I hit, I hit, I hit yeah. a Ray intentionally picked on this kid and continued to do it on more than one occasion. So I do that, he, I do that, that only do that like, where I work. Bro, he messed up, messed up my paper, so I, every time I get a chance, I hit him with whatever ball I can and claim it's an accident. Damn, bro. So then Ray, then Shiraz, and then Rick. Yes, I love, I love how I'm not... I didn't do shit. Wait, what? I'm not in the rankings. You you didn't you didn't say any you didn't say any confessions. Yo, Jota is like, man, fuck that. We hate kids for life. <laughs> My confession was that I I beat up the kids where I work. Basically. You guys are some you guys are some criminals. They're like three to five year old, years old. You guys are a pack of a pack of criminals. Man. Where do you rate yourself among this pack of criminals? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so so I'm the least criminal. I'm biased, but I guess I rate myself um above Rick, but below you, Shiraz. Nigga, you oh, threw shit. a fucking dumbbell at a 
No, 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 no. Where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? You're, you're actually Dan Master, man. You, 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 did some shit. You, you threw a 20 pound dumbbell at a girl's head. Yeah, that's kind of fucked up. Come on, no, no, no. It's my sister. It's my sister. Have you seen Misery? When heavy things hit your head? You die. Oh, I can kill you, bro. <laughs> okay, who? Okay. Yeah, yeah, because uh, it has a sibling. You know, you had, I had to make room because my thing was full. Yeah, I like, throw shit at my sibling all the time, but I make sure yeah. they don't weigh twenty pounds. When you, when, when, when something I was young, hits a person's head, dude, nine out of ten times they're probably gonna either get a concussion and die and fall into a coma or just die. I didn't aim for her head, and you don't understand. Black people have hard ass heads. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, got you there, Rick. Did you not yeah. hear the story of when I pushed my cousin through the glass table and he just got up like it was nothing? Oh, like, you're definitely a you're like right below, dude. Dude, dude, you might be, see. See, here's the thing. Here's the thing. You get me. Oh, you hit well, women. That's fucked up, man. No. Okay. Okay. Here's what makes me not as bad as Shiraz. I do it, but no, I don't. No, no, you're on like you're like equal to Dan. No, yeah. you push the kid on the last table to harm the person. Oh, no, you see, Dan, he jumped the guy, but that guy deserved it. Yeah, but you, you push push women through the glass. You're just throwing shit at your sister that way is twenty fucking. You don't, you don't hit women. That's that's, that's a bitch yeah. move. You, what? Uh, Rick, do you have a sister? I don't know. Yeah. Have you how how much older than you than you is uh, I'm twelve years older than my sister. You're older than her. Yeah, yeah but thing. but see I I practically raised my sister, so Exactly. Okay. But, but this see, is the I like the parent to my sister, so I've had to at times. Okay, my but sister I just don't, look 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 no, I control myself like when she got to a certain age, like all right, there's a certain age though. Well, even though that's your sister, you can't put your hands on them no more. No, and dude. And my sister no, no, done some no, no, fucked up shit to me. Like, like, like. Rick, Rick. She went through this kleptomania. Sister? No, no, listen. <laughs> she went through this kleptomania sleep <laughs> phase where, like, she would steal <laughs> shit. Like, she stole so much shit from me. It was ridiculous. Yeah. And I did not put my hands on her. That's all it is. Yeah. There's, there's a, I mean, when they get to a certain age, you just can't hit them. Okay, no, no, wait, Rick, Rick, Rick. The difference between you and me, my sister is 18 months older than me. She's older. This sounds all bad. And she used to, she used to like, she used to fuck with me all the time, so I, I had an excuse. Wait, why'd you mention 18 months? Why can't you just say a year? A year and a half. A year, I find she's a year, a year and a half older. Year and a half. <laughs> bro, bro, she used to, she used to oh, kick my yeah. ass all the time for no reason, bro. I, I, I had yeah. any way, any way I could, and I used my weapon. I used the weight. Ray, you know what you're going to have to do? All right, there. Ray, you know what you're going to have to do? You're going to have to read the comic to me and show me every panel. What? Uh, I'll do it later. Uh, I can picture Zalan and just taking one of these and just chucking it at a kid. <laughs> Yo, wait, a weight? Yo, yo, I don't throw weights at kids. He's older than me, man. But still, you threw a weight at someone. <laughs> and you guys are fucked up. Did you guys not hear the start of the story? She threw a dictionary at me. Bro, it's a, 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 a thick-ass dictionary. It, it, it took the wind out of me, man. That shit hurt. Okay, wait, it hit your foot, and it's probably like a five-pound max. Oh, it took it so long with that fucking it weight, bro. It took the wind out of you because you a bitch. <laughs> it hit the area yeah. between my, <laughs> my weight. Oh, man. No, but like, here's the thing. Like, I, can just, I can tease out and legit just like, come over here. And he just launches it. Alan, can yeah. you pick up a 20 pound? I was so weak. I was so weak that I could barely pick up the weight myself. Like I barely picked it up. <laughs> yeah, that's all. That's um. <laughs> that's I don't think you funny, could pick up the twenty pound dumbbell. I was young as fuck. I didn't know what I was doing. I took I took the closest thing to me and I chucked it at it. And it just happened. <laughs> it is a vengeance. Yo, oh, Kaki, you, Kaki, you should delete the stream, bro. Too much, too many confessions. I can't delete. Too many trust issues. You're, 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 you're gonna live with it forever. <laughs>
So I, I should have never brought up the idea of doing confessions. Now now people are making fun of me for throwing weights at people. Fucking they call they call it down and I just I'm just trying to like in my mind I'm trying to like go play by play how it would happen. Like I'm I'm not you to explain it to you? No, I'm trying to like I'm trying to go play like let's just say I'm imagining myself in your position trying to like struggle between throwing a weight at someone. <laughs> Yo, if I could barely pick yeah. something up, I'm not gonna throw it at somebody. Okay, this bitch that kicks your ass all the time because she's older than you, she takes a dictionary for no reason and throws it at you and it hurts the shit out of you. Wait, what's her relationship to you? You want to defend Dallas. yourself, Dallas. so you pick up a weight and chuck it Dallas. at you. You were bullied and that sounds like a personal problem. <laughs> I, wasn't bullied. I wasn't bullied, it's my sister, bro. It's my sister. Yeah, you got bullied by your sister. Oh, that's not bullying. That's kind of messed up. How you get bullied by your sister? Oh my, yo, she's older, man. You you guys don't understand the struggle of having an older sister. I need someone with the older sister to come. I got two older like, sisters. Girl, so I'm gonna talk to you now. I push him in front of the train and have him blow up. See, if you grew up with an older sister, you would know that they're mean as fuck. They just they're like, I don't know. They're, 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 they're too nice. I mean. I'm, I'm, like, first of all, like a little kid enjoying this time, bouncing, having a good time. The world means nothing to him. He's just bouncing and he comes out of that nowhere. It's like these big shadows. He's like, I just and you push him and he falls on the table. Like a big old bee. What are you up to? All right, but um, I'm about to end this because I got to turn the air or something. Yeah. But, uh, for the people that did, uh, that uh, were part of the Bible Club, at least the first um, episode that we did, I uh, uh, thank you guys for showing up. I have a question. Did you guys actually talk about Siren in this? What? Did you guys actually talk about Siren? Yeah, we did for like, um, for how long? We did it for a while. I like Siren. I like Siren. It was like the first... First hour or so was about Siren. Right? That's because we only did the first ten. We only did the first ten chapters. Not a whole lot happened. Really. I mean, not everything. Yeah, for the real first ten. All right now. But, uh, oh, okay. <clears throat> Wait till you get to the ending. Hockey's already. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Shit. That's about it. See you uh, uh, <laughs> with a uh, more more siren talk. Show me rainbow and I'm a bear. With more beautiful music. Oh, I'm a bear. Show me rainbow and Cody eating ice cream. Yo, sing sing the JoJo's of. Uh...